<clears throat> oh boy. Here we go, streaming again. I knew this is going to get all messed up. <laughs> I didn't like how it was set. Yeah, that looks good. Let's lean in. Gotta make sure when I'm leaning and squinting at stuff that I can still on camera. All right. <clears throat> Where's my headset? Make uh, sure my volume is correct. It is not. There we go. So uh, we are back. Had a heck of a moment earlier where I realized as I was making it live. Oh, why is this Armstrong video only 10 minutes? <laughs> So I had to delete that and re-upload the proper one. Uh, see what happened. What had happened. And this, I usually catch it, but you know, I'm very bad about reviewing um, the final stuff, especially after I got that audio stuff fixed. Uh, so what happened this time is you can see here on the timeline. See how it says two there? This is the second hour. It's not two hours and 30 minutes. So the, it starts with one. See, but that's not one hour in. That's 36 minutes in the first hour. So what had happened was I had that much. And I was like, oh, an hour and 10 minutes. And when the timeline zoomed in, it's like, oh, that looks like a lot more. So I just slapped it all together and rendered it and put it up. <laughs> yeah, read it. I should have noticed when the uh, when everything was so quick that uh, I had messed something up. But I managed to get the new notice it in time, got the new render made, and put it up, and it's live. So the hey Hork, no, so the uh, sixth episode is up, and I'm gonna be honest. The sixth episode is going to be the best. And so I, I looked at what was left after that. Essentially, after the sixth episode, uh, I was still midstream. So I finished the stream and was messing around. But by, by the end of the stream, I realized I was done. I, uh, I just wanted to move on to other content. And uh, so... I was happy with what happened in episode six, essentially, as being the finale. So it's not going to be the finale of the playlist because there's still more content after that. Uh, but what I'm going to do is episode six is essentially the climax. And the last episode is going to be a very long, chunky episode. It's going to be like three hours long, but it's all just basically faffing about and getting up to, to no good. I think there's one point where I, um, I refit a lot of the ships, so there's some shipbuilding action, and I think there's some fights, but there's nothing really as big as what happens in Episode 6. So Episode 6 is at by far the best of Armstrong, and uh, I'll put the final up um, soon. Probably, I'll probably work on that tomorrow or Sunday and have it up either tomorrow or Sunday. Uh, it's a big chunky video, and uh, once we're done with that, um, I think I'm going to move on to start chopping up this playthrough, because uh, there's a lot to this playthrough, I think it's a lot more interesting to watch, and uh, it has the good audio, although I didn't realize the second half of Armstrong actually does have the good audio, the second half being, I think, episode... Four or five is when I get into using the new microphone. And so it, it sounds better. And uh, with this one, like, it's going faster than I was expecting. <clears throat> We're clearing through a lot of uh, objectives. And uh, I would imagine this is actually going to get finished sometime next week. And I was thinking that it might take weeks and weeks, but no, not really. <laughs> so um, 
after this one, I think I'm going to plan an Ashes of the Domain playthrough. And maybe return to trying to do the Wingcom suite because I'll have the new OBS set up. So I might return to Russell. But I do have those other playthroughs. I do want to do some other stuff as well. I'll figure it out. We'll get through. We'll find always find more stuff to do because I have plenty of ideas on stuff to do. Um <clears throat> so we have our game, we have our mods. I think. I forgot to delete on the mod list yesterday that I took out FSF and a couple other things. So, I need, so that mod list is probably inaccurate. But essentially, we're just playing with new level of confidence, few hall mods, aptly simple, uh, more hall mods, um, unusually gullible hall mods, and experimental hall modifications which is uh, a bit cursed with Arma, but I don't care. <clears throat> it's, it's fun. I'm enjoying it. And uh, we have Arma. We have autosave. We have larger zoom. Uh, our support, Lazy, Magic, and Luna. <clears throat> we have Nexalyn, So we're doing the derelict scenario. We have progressive S mods, which the more I thought about it, I really kind of like this more than the original system. Because the original system, especially when I already know what mods I'm going to build in, it's like everything's getting stabilized shields. And with experimental hall mod, everything's getting stabilized shields and experimental hall mod. Uh, the exper or over engineering. So it's like only two mods in every ship. Doesn't really leave a lot of room. But with progressive S mods, we can keep investing in our ships and adding more um, hull mods, which I really appreciate. I really like doing that. Uh, we have scanned those gates. I um I think I mentioned it a couple of times during this playthrough at the start. Uh, but this is a really handy mod when you're playing with the story already finished, because it essentially already it just lets you scan all the gates in the open market. Uh, so you don't have to um go run around and tag them all, which is really convenient. You can also use it to reveal where the hyper shunts and the cryo sleepers are, but I'm not using those. I just wanted to know where the gates were and have them scanned already. Uh, Simple player faction fags. We're not even actually using any of them. Uh, it's just, you know, something I have on. We got speed up. We got uh, talent ship works for the, mostly for the Legio uh, pirates. Um, a lot of times I end up using some of the talent ship work weapons, but this time it's more just for the pirates. Uh, honestly, I probably should put some of those weapons on though because they're they're pretty good. But I haven't really collected a bunch. Um, I don't know why, but uh, Lethia didn't spawn. It spawned on the false start we did, the first start, or before we restarted. I observed Lethia was there, but this time it didn't show up, and I don't know why. Um, it might have something to do with um, like maybe it spawned too close to something else. I don't know. But it's not here, so uh, we haven't really gotten a place where we can just go get those things. But it's fine, because I wasn't really going to focus on the those parts. I just wanted this for the pirates more than anything. Uh, we have terraforming and space station construction. We're starting to do some terraforming on our colonies we have. Um, that's going to be a lot of the focus for today, is getting the colonies built up, getting our empire built up, and liberating some other people. Uh, and then we have Witch Mod. Um, when it comes to liberating other colonies, what we're doing is we're limiting how many of the uh, loose colonies that are remaining that the enemy factions can capture by capturing them ourselves and giving them away to the independents. Oh, and that is everything. So let's get started. Uh, we did end up having... Um, we gave the Ludic Church one of our colonies in our system, and I'm kind of regretting it. I'm thinking I would have rather have abandoned it, but I was hoping to kind of ally with them. But they allied, I forget who they allied with. I think they allied with uh, Sindria or something. And now it's like, I don't know who I want to ally with. Uh, 
we did get a offer from the hegemony, but I'll be damned. <laughs> Especially considering uh, in this part, we're probably going to start. I mean, we are going to be making use of AI cores um, because I kind of want to capture more planets like in Both, where we have our level seven colony. There's still, yeah, there's a level six derelict world here we could capture, which looks pretty juicy. There's a little five one here. Not as juicy, but could be useful because it could potentially do something with Ferrer. Not sure. Um, and then we have this one here. And I feel like grabbing these would really be a great idea since they're all together in another system, and then we'll have Both and Alberry. But Alberry is our main system, and we did liberate everything here. We have that Ludic Church and that uh, independent colony. And then we have all of our colonies. Which, uh, they're doing all right now. We're uh, starting to pay off our debt. I need to go and take care of these... Uh, at some point, but these are really far away. Well, that's next door. But these are both over, I think these are in, Oberon is the LI system. So we need to run over there and take care of that. Oh. Yeah, our income is looking all right now. We still have a ton of debt to pay off, but now that we're actually bringing in money every month, will start to offset that significantly. And that's only going to get better. Um, we also... Now that we... have our own stuff... We need the Condor, because we don't really have anything fancy. Uh, we have the gremlin because we don't have anything fancy there either. We'll probably do some exploring at some point as well. So that we can, uh... And I would, I want to prioritize the Arma ships though. I wish there was a way to force that. Maybe we drop the venture? Still want to use the venture though. So we don't have any other cruisers. Well, at least that ends up with some of the things in. Um at least this puts the mechs into the uh into the fight. So we'll do it like that. We'll just focus on more carriers over warships. Especially since we don't have that many warships. <clears throat> um focus on quality or officer quality ship size we do smaller ship size maybe that'll help things out someone with a bunch of shepherds rather not use the shepherds then yeah that looks better and uh steady is fine uh what do we have we had some ships we needed to build up where are we right now And we are home. Okay. All right. So now it was time to do some AI switch. Um, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine AI ships to put together. <coughs> but we only have seven of these. We need to save these for the colonies. We need one for the simulator anyway. So we'll use our two beta cores in these, and then we'll use two, three, four, five, six, we have six guys. We have five alpha cores though. Um, it's fine. We'll just have this one running around without a core. Oh, we actually... 
did the AI core on this too, didn't I? No, I didn't. I was thinking of doing AI core on this. So maybe we do one, two, three, four, five, and then we just leave these without cores for now. We'll come back to them. And that's what we'll do. And then this one, we need to get in shape as well. Um, <clears throat> I want to balance things out a bit more because I want to put that like that. It's not so bad. And then more Balkans. That's okay. Um, oh, do I need to boost its speed? I do. So there's a whole lot I need to go find, which is another thing, reason why I want to go exploring. Is out there somewhere is a fuel additive mod that will allow us to increase the burn rating. Stick bug on the troop carrier. Would you name it ship? Stick bug? Which uh, troop carrier? This guy? Stick bug it is. <clears throat> Boom. Our marine training facility slash invasion <laughs> boat. It's so weird running around with a bunch of destroyer support ships. I'm so used to having other ships by now. But with uh, Tritachion squished, we don't really have... Um, we haven't really been seeing too many revenants floating around. And the only way we're going to find them is um, coming across them in the wild. All right, so I need to decide how I'm going to fill this thing up. I think we're just going to put pylums on. And then... That's going to be it. Hopefully it stays out of combat. It's not as fast or as durable as the Heron when it comes to capacity and shield, but it has more armor and hull. So hopefully that won't be as big of a deal. I mean, I just don't want them to get into combat, period. <clears throat> I wish we could turn them AI, but then it um, it removes the ability to put uh, any crew in, so you can't use the, uh, the fighters. I think there's another mod that will let me automate fighters that aren't already drones. But uh, we don't have it. <laughs> All right, let's drop. Oh, we have to drop 10 of your capacitors to get the AI switch on you. But that's fine. Uh, we have plenty. We're gonna integrate all these boys. Um, you need chip systems so you use it more. Uh, field modulation, but also impact mitigation. And I'm not really worried about the damage. I just want you to do your thing. So we'll get the ECM out. Although with all the AI having ECM, we don't need that as much as on our, on our officers. What are our officers doing for picking up gunnery implants? Still probably do it though. But it's something that I should have remembered early on. I mean, I wasn't thinking of using the AI until I realized, oh, I'm going to level 40, I might as well. Uh, we'll save you for last. Uh, you guys are already built, so let's put you in. And we'll go in and uh, we'll look at them in a second to fill out their skills. All right, uh, this is ballistics. Um, they have, hold on, they have dampener field. But dampener field doesn't count as a ship system. It's blink is their ship system. So we should put gunnery implants, um, I guess ballistics, 
and maybe polarized armor for this one or just impact mitigation doesn't need the extra maneuverability but the extra flux dissipation will probably help it out so let's go with impact or polarized armor because then we can drop the uh, resistant flux catalyst because uh, it'll have plenty of resistance on for EMP and stuff. And uh, we got heavy armor already. How much is front loaded armor? Four. Let's go ahead and do that. Because they mostly get hit, they're mostly face tanking stuff. So I think that will help them out. Then we'll do something similar with this guy. What did you get? Pulse rifle. Boost Knuckle, Mining Blaster, so your Energy Specialization. I'll just do you the same way, but with Energy Specialization. <clears throat> and again, we can pull that off. And we can put on Front Loaded Armor. The where's the other gun? That'll be fine. <laughs> yeah, I'm happy with that. <clears throat> All right, you. Uh, you have a ballistics weapon, but it's more about shredding fighters than it is. But it doesn't count as a point defense weapon. It's a anti-fighter weapon. So I think we go... No, you don't know. With this one, we want the ship system to fire. The advanced fire control system, increasing damage dealt to a number of enemies within the radius by 25% based on the combined ECM rating of nearby allies versus that of the enemy. Oh, so it's like an, a huge... Very nice. Okay, so there is a reason for us to get gunnery implants on everyone. Even better. Oh, you don't need polarized armor. Boom. <clears throat> All right, big boy. Uh... Oh, wait, hold on. No, no, no. I was going to think put an officer in this, wasn't I? So I'm going to take someone out of something else and put them in that. Like, maybe her? No, you know what? Red Boy is going to be in uh, AI. <clears throat> now, what do you have? You have a large energy and a medium hybrid. I don't want to just go... at 800 damage per second and it's consistent like if we get like that and then just throw on some swarmers old reliable and then safety overrides Yeah, I think this will be fine. Uh, what's your special skill? <clears throat> fire bolt feeder increases damage and fire rate by 25%. All reducing flux cost by 10%. Alright. So let's further reduce the flux cost. And increase that. So no gunnery implants, but it's fine. I think that's going to be better off. Oh, the range doesn't match up. 
Maybe instead of the pastille, we do something else. Let me give him an ion pulser. The range still won't match up there, but. <clears throat> It'll be easier to manage the flux. Oh yeah, much easier. I think that's better. And then we can give him the... Uh... Oh wait, no, you're a destroyer, right? Just give it more flux. This has got a lot going on with these two weapons. It's like, look at this thing. Actually, I'm really tempted to throw the pastille on here anyway. Since I completely forgot the range isn't going to matter with safety overrides. I think Plasma Cannon Ion Pulsar still. But, what if instead of upping the vents, we give it the uh, Split Chamber. That do again all right that drops the shield but makes it stronger uh i don't want to lower the damage anymore split chambers already can cut the damage by 40 percent what i want is i want the opposite of that i want to be able to buff the damage back up but now i'm really thinking about the fact that uh the magazine is going to slow it down. Alright, this should actually work out because... Ah, uh, yeah. I like that. Split Chamber is fantastic. Alright, so yeah, we'll stick with that. Uh, these guys, I want to make them consistent. Uh, don't have officers in them yet. Just have a small universal turret and the medium missile. Um, they're mostly here for their Tempest-like ability. They actually have Terminator Sequence, essentially. UWS Strike. It's basically the same thing as Terminator Sequence. And, uh... I don't think what would actually we don't really have a lot of missiles unfortunately so maybe just more boom tubes Let them fly around and do crazy stuff and then universal turret heck it oh, i don't have enough antimatter blasters for everyone um i don't think i have extended missile rack either i do not They can just point defense. Because once they run out of missiles, essentially all I want them to do is survive. Do the burst PD laser. We'll go with the other laser they have. And then they don't have shields. So maybe we give them the heavy armor. And reinforce the bulkheads. They don't need anything for flux except for their skill. How much does their skill use? Oh, that's easy. 
Okay, no big deal there. So we have one more point to drop reinforced bulkheads for something else. Actually, I'm thinking, yeah, insulated engines and resistant flux capacitor. I bet mean, they don't get disabled too easy. All right, now, let's see if we can copy this easily. That's what I was worried about. <laughs> Uh, you gotta be real careful with the copy pasta using experimental hall modifications. Oh, so I didn't actually do all that much, so we'll get right back into it. I love experimental hall modifications, but it, it uh, it's buggy. Yes, right, indeed. It's okay. There's about to be an ad on Twitch, so I'll just, by the time you guys get back from that, <laughs> I'll have everything caught back up. So I already know what I'm doing. Ugh. Wait, I don't remember everything, but <laughs> it'll be fine. <sighs> Sorry, this guy. Uh, no, it was, I think it was something like that for the best defense. Where did I go with the shield? I think I want the shield. Maybe I don't do gunnery implants and we do the missile specialization for, nah, you know what? If it runs out of booms, it just zooms. It'll be fine. Also, let's give this guy a red shield. This guy already has a red shield. All right, and it was plasma cannon, pastille, swarm racks. Uh, split chamber, safety overrides. Four more points. I don't remember if we found anything we would do. What the circuit breakers do? Reduces their overloads. Decrease stamina. Uh, no, we don't need that. Targeting transceiver. No, we don't need that. I think I just do the extra invents. <clears throat> What's your skill again? All right, yeah, slightly increased weapon fire rate. That's fine. Although with the split chamber, we don't really need it. But we don't have the space to build anything else. Probably build in the AI switch first, and then we can uh, change up some other stuff. Maybe add some extra hull mods. Uh, then these we just, oh. Oh, so just, I have to have them in my inventory to be able to put them in. Oh, it's this guy. I was confusing it for the other one anyway. So no, 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 no. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. These guys are the ones that don't need that. Right, right, right. Nope. And this one is energy weapons.
happy when I say. Got it all done before the ad. All right, uh, I think we AI switched this guy to, no, not yet, going to though. Basically almost everything in our fleet aside from the carriers and the ships our officers are in are gonna get converted over. Ooh, actually no, our automated ship skill. How high does it go again? Is it 160? 120. We're already buttoned up against that. Okay. Um, well, probably have to cut some people at some point. Because these guys are... That's 20. That's only 18. Why is it so expensive? It's probably these guys right there. No, they're not that expensive. Why is my automated ship skill so high? Quoto. Which one's the Quoto? Is that this guy? It is this guy. Right. Okay. Might just leave these without officers then. Because I want to absolutely put these guys in. Alright, how bad does that decrease our maximum is 90? Why is ours only 76? Oh, the maximum is 50. The maximum is 76 for these guys. Oh, thank you for asking, Fork. No, it was not. Hey, Sedramir. Uh, uh... Oh, I forgot this guy, too. Switch into the long range. <clears throat> hey, Sedramir with the follow. Appreciate it. As opposed to, you know, what took you so long? <laughs> All right, so I want to keep those two guys. Those are my those are my sidekicks. Um, I want to keep these guys now. I think we just turn these off of the AI switch instead of doing that because I'm running out of space for uh, AI ships, and that gives us more space to put stuff on them. Let's go ahead and put the reinforced bulkheads back on. Wellness check. I have my coffee. So I have my water, and I just ate. So I'm doing pretty good. How you doing? Did you get your DoorDash? You're still waiting. Oh, we gotta put a boom tube in here. It's the only thing that fits that mount. <laughs> um, I can use a storm needler out in the field. Well, I just told you I'm doing fine. I got my coffee, I got my water. Oh, you're asking me where your DoorDash is at? I can find out. Guardian protocol. Flux shots. Hard flux 50% of normal rate while shields are on. Fantastic. Um Yeah, I guess we just give him that th thick shield. And um bat vents. Help him dissipate that flux. I almost want to safety overrides it, but I don't want to drop the range on the Storm Needler. And he's got field modulation, so that's going to be a thick boy. Oh, that's the wrong weapon. Love this thing.
Or maybe we go Mjolnir instead. It's just so satisfying hearing that sound, isn't it? I think we're going to Mjolnir instead. I don't really need a Heavy Needler, we're fine. We got plenty of annoying little strike craft, we don't need a Heavy Needler. Um... Oh, can we not safety overrides? Incompatible with the flux shunt. That makes sense. It would be. Alright, so we'll just crack out the vents, give him a little capacitor, he'll be fine. <clears throat> you. This is new? What am I gonna do with you? Uh, sniper. I feel like I was going to change her around. I don't remember why I put her in this. Oof. Um, maybe give her the heavy needler. Or give her a double rail gun. And the velocity driver. And the assault gun over the shoulder. Just a uh, harass. But she's got. Oh, she has missile specialization, so we should give her some kind of missile. <clears throat> I think breachers. So once she pops somebody's shield, she can nail it with the breacher. And what I'll do is I'll put the give her the gallant on one of those mounts, and then on the offhand, give her a light needler. She's just going to be spraying all over the place. It's going to be great. <clears throat> Alright, my new boy, what are we going to give you? Uh, first of all, which paint job? Do I have, a, I have one with Seraphin, so let's use the standard paint job. Um, pile bunker, small ballistics, so let's go with a ballistic setup. Be something on a discount. And then... <clears throat> oh, I take the weapons out real quick. Uh, and then I can do Mass Universal on the small ones. And we can give him some more ballistics. I don't think he's actually going to use the heavy machine gun on defense. Let's give him the, the thumper instead. And... Oh, we've already got the light assault gun. I think we're better off with the rail guns. Do a little bit more damage, a little bit more range. What happened? <laughs> oh, we ruined all of our fun numbers with freaking. They're the, the the power skill. I forget what it's called. Um, you got maneuverability chats. Yeah, go like that. 
And then for you, you are a phase shift. Uh, what do we end up giving that ship? Nothing yet. Okay, small hybrid. You've got the Juno. You're all energy weapons, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So... I'll give you the Ion Buster for now. And... Energy ship system. Um... I actually think combat endurance is uh right until we get like their ship skills are gonna be like their uh combat readiness is gonna be a little on the low side because of how many automated ships we have uh integrated targeting Oof. polarized armor because he's a uh, base ship he doesn't have shields um let's go ahead and give you the split chamber and anti hull armor or anti armor ammo and then phase anchor oh i see you don't need phase anchor if you have split chamber uh resistant flux catalyst um uh, well. It's not a lot of armor, but it's better than nothing. Keep them alive. And then some vents. How's this look? Oh, critical malfunction. Which probably, uh... Wait, why do you have a critical malfunction? Effective manufacturing. Damage weapon mounts. Oh. Is that just something that happens automatically with this guy? Just a thing? Turn weapon ion. Oh, is it not allowed to have the ion buster on it? Doesn't say that anywhere. That's interesting. Okay, so we can't have the ion buster on that. That's weird. I wasn't expecting that. Um, something that could be useful. And we do the antimatter blaster. I mean, if we're doing split chamber. We just do a pulse laser then? No. Wait. Oh, I think I know what's happening. Okay, it's giving it to them, isn't it? Yeah, it's not failing. It's just that's how it does it. That's why it makes that noise every time. So that's how it gives the weapons to those guys. Okay, interesting. Yeah, Iron Pulse Laser. Okay, interesting. Cool, 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 cool. So let's give them the uh, Iron Buster. And then we go into the fight. Armor Iron Buster installed. And yeah, now they have the Iron Buster. Okay, I thought it was failing, but no, it was just doing what it's supposed to do. And then what's that split chamber look like for your guns now? I believe this takes forever, I forgot about that. Uh homie lasers. Does that glaive actually push you back? Oh it does. <laughs> That's funny. And then how's the Juno? Oh that's insane. Love it. Alright. Good, good, good. All right, that's our team for now. Uh, we're at 143 on the ships. So their maximum readiness is 84. I'm thinking we actually go back. Maybe change to give them combat readiness or I just drop someone. Uh, I think that's the reason why I didn't want to put this guy in, but it's fine. They're fine. They're fine. They don't need the extra combat readiness. They'll be fine. They're super strong. All right. Oh, we have a prisoner now. Fantastic. We didn't have one before. If we had literally had one prisoner before. We would have been able to solve that problem with the, the invasion that was coming our way. But now, now we don't need to worry about it. Okay. Um. All 
Arby's is building an atmospheric processor and it's going to install our shade. We're going to change that over completely to a new planet. Fuel production's here for now, but that's going to get moved to uh, Custom Elite. We just need the money for it. Uh, B scam. We need to go capture those other markets in Big Scam or in that system. They can handle a free port now. So we'll get more money there. Like, look at that, 70 extra. It's fantastic. Um, we also need to go find some colony items or build some colony items. I think we can build them, right? No, maybe not. Custom Elite doesn't have an orbital works yet, does it? We're gonna need to go to a place with an orbital works in order to build colony items. And I can't remember if that's a thing that I can do with vanilla Nexalin or if that's like one of the other mods that I'm not using. I can't remember. But it's fine. We'll just go capture a bunch of them anyway. Because uh, today we raiding. Stock up. Let's lose a bunch of money. Uh, we have one more slot in our fleet, but we don't have anything in it to take with us. Um, probably end up putting another, uh, oh, you know what I want to put there? I want to put one of the, um, the Colossus. I'm going to go get one of those at some point. Probably go beat up some pirates and get one. Okay, uh, we have four AI cores. Now, one of those is going in the simulator, but three of them could become administrators. Because so we don't have a new administrator yet until our colonies level up even further. And we don't have a lot of colonies that need leveling up. Or that are gonna, like, this will level up soon, but then like the rest of them are gonna take a while. This one will level up pretty quickly. Uh, but these are already maxed. Arby's is actually leveling up quickly too. Does this actually help your growth? Cryo Sanctum? Or is it just, you know, for meat snacks? What are you guys hanging around for? I guess they just got into a fight. Alright, um... So, Smock... We never even looked at Smock, did we? Oh, we did look at it, but it was like... Nothing is special. I don't think there was even any, uh... There's no ruins there, either. Uh, we don't have any money to go to gambling, so let's just go here. Get into liberation. That's already independent. These are all derelict. That's already independent. Um, then this is Minos. Minos is level 6. That'll be an, e an easier fight. That's just an orbital station, whereas this is a battle station. Oh, oh I didn't bring any weapons, did I? Crap. Uh, I need to get some weapons. Should be able to get weapons at uh, Beak Scam. Rebellion at Ice Ball still. Alright, hold on. Thought we had taken care of that, but I'd forgotten. A couple atmospheric processors are complete, so let's actually go ahead and start those. That's Arby's and rocks and stuff. So let's start making an atmosphere. Arby's, normalize atmospheric density. Uh, rocks and stuff, normalize atmospheric density. Oh, there we are, look at that. Okay. So, big scam. We just need a pristine nano forge. So that's going to be our first goal, really, is getting a pristine nano forge. We do have a mothership we can go check out. Might be able to get one from there. Get something from there for sure. Uh, ice ball. Yeah, where's ice ball?
<laughs> yeah, well. Uh, help with the rebellion. Here's a bunch of supplies and a butt ton of marines. There's some more supplies. Get rid of that rebellion. Freaking uh, Legios started a rebellion there with an operative. And then we had to count. They had to invade it, take it back. So rebellion is still ongoing. Yeah, I'm not interested. That was the alliance offer from the hegemony. I do not care. Uh, don't need that many gun. We only need like. 600. Alright. More derelict stuff getting captured. Oh, you're actually fighting? Who are you even fighting? Uh, bounty hunter. Well, unfortunately, you brought a lot of heat over here, guy. I don't think I want any part of this, but you know what? Here, we'll go in. Got some free, uh, what do you call it? Damage sponges. All right, so team one is now you guys. Team two is now All of you. Team three. And then team four. Team five. Alright, so we definitely want one and two to come in. Uh, five. I'll bring in the big guy. Uh, I'll bring in the afflictor. And I'll bring in the flagellator. And then, uh, I have enough points for this guy as well. Okay. Alright. We're going in as well. What's the enemy status? I'm not even on the map yet. Come on. There we go. Alright. I want all of my team to follow me, and we're gonna go beat up these assholes. this You Bruh, it teleported me back. That's awesome. It's like, oh, you need refit. Get back here. Thanks, buddy. This thing is awesome. <laughs> of course, that's going to pull my guys out of the fight as well. Because they're going to come hang out by me. Why are you in range of the plasma cannons? Why is everyone getting got? Hold on. What's going on here? Pretty much all those independent guys are gone. All right, so we really need to get into the station. Oh, 
Oh, you know what? I think this thing has an AI on it. We might not actually be able to beat this thing. Cheese it. Oof. We got shut down. I know flame out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, engine's online. All right. Try and get in here and disable the shield generator. Oh, gotta be careful. Flying poorly. I don't think I can shut it down. I think it's just on. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Why'd you teleport me back? <laughs> I'm literally gonna win the fight. What'd you do that for? Jackass. <laughs> uh, it's not everything. Oh, there's still a guy out there. All right, you guys should like do your own returns. Yeah, get in there. They've got that. Alright, let's go. Oh, Don is still repairing. Come on, Don. Hurry up. We're waiting on you. Alright, the other guy can catch up. He's fast. Oh, never mind. They got him. Oh, that was actually closer than I wanted it to be, but we're fine. Uh, why do we have to fight more defenders? All right, um, this should be fine with just us. Inbound for combat range. Your eyes on the scope. We'll have enemy Man, that frag beam is nice. I, I keep forgetting how long range it is. Just reaching out from a mile and zapping dudes. That little kamikaze shit. He's gonna keep getting blown up, I bet. Alright, orbital bombardment. Pack bomb. Uh, invade? Uh, they still have a lot of power, and we don't have a lot of marines, so we're going to need to disrupt them. How many marines? Only 18 lost? Good. What we'll do is we'll... Yeah, there we go. I was going to say we'll wait until the next batch of marines gets trained up. I think it's a week each week.
each week. Okay, so we'll wait for the second week. I specifically hit them for extra. Get rid of the metal. So we'll wait for the next batch of Marines. Oh, I guess Syndria isn't with uh, our uh, church. Oh, you guys showed up now. Whatever. Just waiting for my next batch of Marines. Okay. Uh, but they're not going to get in our way. That's nice. Uh, what's the invasion look like now? Yeah, we got this. I would like you to split that up instead of being a whole bunch of freaking big units. Well, a bunch of mobile units so you can catch all these nerds and they scatter all over the place. Yeah, look at that. Easy clap. Alright, um... Oh! You already live here! Well, we'll just put you right inside of, uh... You're gonna be in charge now, okay? Enjoy. Um, report. And... Do your thing. Just let me know if you need anything, and I'm gonna go fly off and do some more nonsense. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna leave everything here the way it is. It's not rare ore. That is rare ore. I'm gonna shut down the fuel production, change that to light industry. Since it's already got the mining for the uh, organics. Then again, the mining I might shut down as well, because it's not really that useful. But we'll see. Right now, I don't have the money to do any of that crap. Weapons. I like those things. This is one of the guns I was thinking that I about not that I don't have because they're kind of cool. Just don't know where I'd put them on. Go ahead and grab a bunch though. All right. Um. I mean, I guess we let them continue to because I think they still deliver even though we're no longer part of there. Like we changed over. Oh, are you about to pull me into another fight, guy? Some pirates over here fighting. Apparently we can take this station. Game thinks we can. It's only a level 2 AI core there. Does not have a minefield. I still think what we do is we raid it first. Then, yeah, look, that lowered its combat readiness. And... Then with the salvage fleet on our side, we should be able to easily do it. Again, you know, bullet sponges. Uh, bring in team one, team two, bring in the carriers, bring in the big guy, bring in the afflictor, the zapper, bring in the freligator, bring in these guys. Oh, we can bring in everyone. Heck yeah. All right. Uh, hold on. You go ahead and go with that guy. Nice. Time that just right so I could make my team for myself. Um, you go with the other big guy. Um, uh, then you two. Don't go too close. Right there should be good. Yeah, we'll just let everyone else fly around. I need to micromanage these guys a little bit, but there's no defense here. It's just the oh, something to get out here in time to help that. Oh, there's some defenses. All right, so let's go shred these guys up. Let so that way everyone else can focus on the uh, station.
hide behind the big guys, take advantage of their shields. Man, that guy's just going in. He's my hero. Cool, they have needlers. Sorry. Oh, hey. Oh, thanks for the recall. I guess. I mean, it brought me out of the fight, but... I think that's definitely going to be... Like, it's not going to be an, as annoying as it is going to be useful. It is a Gundam. It is, we got we got some of the full-size boys with us now. Uh, the Legio decided to start things up, so... Uh, I decided it was time to upgrade. We got the big boys. I also went full experimental. You may notice that my laser is upgraded. We have a crotch laser now. It goes... <laughs> oh, I think it didn't die? I, yeah, it's dead. Trying to EMP them. Big bada boom. Oh, we didn't lose anyone. All the independent guys got whacked. Not all of them. But, uh, we didn't lose anyone. Oh, we did. That guy. Who's that guy? Ah, yeah, they're built to blow up. It's literally their job. Get blown up. Alright, you know how it be. Fuel delivery service. And, uh... Right, we already raided them today. No, thank you. We have only 11 fighter bays. The Spriggans, we may actually get rid of the Spriggans so that we can uh, cut that back. Master fighter replacement's important. So we have the Einhanders and they have uh, flight decks as well. And I still want to add those, uh, the Colossus. So we may end up getting rid of the Spriggans just for that. We've got enough boom tubes in our fleet. We don't need the Spriggans on top of that. Um, I think just regular coordinated maneuvers, though. I li it literally put Armored Core Project Phantasma. That's hilarious. <laughs> yeah, um, let me see if I can fix that real quick. All I decide what skill to use. Um, I mean, honestly, I'm not incredibly surprised that that was... A that that's what it chose because it chooses it on its own but hopefully i can go in there and uh fix that right off the bat no this is not made for kids gaming game title star sector save hopefully that changes that because uh and the joke is that we're playing, you know, Arma, which is based on Armored Core. That's why it's Arma Core. And I already did an Arma Core playthrough recently. <laughs> yeah, no, I know, right? It's like, oh, well, there's robots. They must be talk. You know, it must be Arma Core. Arma. All right. Um... Trying to think how we should upgrade ourselves and our fleets or fleets. I'm using an energy weapon. We already got energy weapon mastery. Um, polarized armor could probably help me out because when I use, there's a lot of times where I could easily get overloaded, and this would help me uh, 
he'll protect me when my booty is overloaded. But I think coordinated maneuver is just the way to go. Because it's going to increase my uh, command point recovery, which is nice. It's going to increase um, the overall speed. We get like an actual 20% speed on top of what we've already got. And that's across the board for everyone. It's all ships with officers, including the flagships, which uh, includes our AI boys. So, yeah, that's the way to go. Um, still haven't finished. One, two, three. All right, what's the invasion look like? We still have this. Militia are basically worthless. Why are you such small units again? I know I don't have a lot of guys, but... You don't need to make it even worse by making only a few units. We need to be able to catch them when they start running around. Sheesh. All right. Should be like two rounds, maybe three. Uh, this will be four. Oh, rocks and stuff got bigger. Nice. Wow. Five. Okay. Oh, we got it though. Oh, we didn't rename that other one. What was that other one called? Minos? You're not Minos anymore. Uh, you're a Tundra World. We already have an Ice Hall and... What do we have? We have Dirt. Shout out to Earth. Uh, we have Ice Ball. Um... Only so much we could do with these tundra worlds. This one we're gonna definitely lean into the mining and the food production still. Uh you know what? We'll just keep it as Minos. And we'll keep this one as fairer. This is like the side system. We don't we ain't, we ain't come here a lot. Got those uh, beta cores in the industry. I don't know. But uh, oh, I didn't bring them with me. No, I did. Oh, we got to be there though. We technically weren't docked. There we go. Boom! Get in there. Make it work. Um, we got a military base. That's nice. It's not going to be up and running for uh, forever, but it's nice. So military base is actually one of the things I wanted here, so that works out. I really wish that, uh, you know what I would like to see an update in the vanilla game? When you open the com directory, I want to see the administrator. Like, why can't we just talk to our AI boy and gain his trust so that he doesn't like, you know, flip out when we try to pull him out. I think that'd be cool. All right, what's left here? We got that, we got that. This one, off ledge, which is out there. This has bad Wi-Fi. <laughs> I mean, that's true. You don't want to give your uh, AI cores good Wi-Fi. Uh, that's Independence. They got whacked by those guys. Oh, hello. Had many inspectors. Oh, what a coincidence. Uh, we'll just sit here and watch you do that. It's free lunch. Um, are you going to finish that? Oh, I think I know what's going to happen. I don't think the hegemony inspectors can actually do this. Like, I think it just continues. They're just in an endless fight. Oh, no. They did do it. Okay. There was one time when I saw them literally in an endless fight. What? Who is you? Who are these smugglers? Like, the derelict smugglers are like actual humans supporting the derelict. Like, it's insane. All right, well, uh, what's the invasion look like? Mm, too good. We got to do something about it. Oh, now we got to fight the guys. All right, whatever. Lunch can only be so free. Well, what's the enemy 
A bunch of losers. Do whatever you want. I want that veil. I split you in half. Oh, you got him? You probably have him. I'm gonna help finish him. Ooh. He got out of the way just in time. I think he actually ate one of those. Um, I was tempted to take the veil if it was available. <laughs> it was available. All right, tacky bombs. Yeah, the veil is pretty fun. It's just too good, so it's like, I don't want to, like, grab too. I don't want to, like, I don't, I, I know if I were to grab it, it would, like, oh, no, I'm not interested. Um, all right, let's talk. <clears throat> Tom Stabilized, the Hegemony Fleet Commander, appears before you straight-backed and stern-faced. Citizen, this non-chartered volume is now non-chartered volume, my nuts, is now the subject of an active operation to investigate the possible use of forbidden AI technologies. I invoke full martial use of force protocol per hegemony diktats, uh, cut homily power up weapons, move in, fight. <clears throat> We're going in as well. What's the enemy status? Uh I accidentally didn't bring my support ships with us. We need to go capture some calm buoys first. Oh, that guy though. He's gonna regret his decisions in life. Hey guy, hey guy, hey guy, hey guy, hey guy, hey guy. Oh, you were looking the wrong way, guy. <laughs> That double thumper is insane. Ah, fighters, our weakness. <laughs> All right, bring those guys in and uh, bring the freligator in. Flagellator. I keep calling him freligator. <laughs> it's flagellator. All right. Um, we're gonna park you here and park you here. And uh. Don't worry about that anymore. And I need those guys in the front line. Um, you hang out with that one. Actually, both of you guys just hang out together. I'm not worried about this calm buoy. We have it. We got what we needed. All right, guys. Where's their carrier? It's back there. They have two legions, so that's going to be part of the problem. But we can at least get this condor. blow up against the, the legion but it's fun all right how are we looking out here Oof. that's what they do they're psychos um you guys come in and support against this uh you tackle that did they already destroy the other legion or did it burn out somewhere i don't see it out here it didn't come in yet did it no, I saw two legions. Did they already crisp one? They did. Oh, it got turned around, and so I guess they jumped it. All right, that worked. Cool. Uh, well, this is an easy fight. I was worried about this, but a little bit. 
Let's just go in and finish this guy off. Hey, I inspect me, motherfuckers. I inspect you. How about that? <laughs> you keep it shoved. to keep their engines shut. Oh, that one's toasted. Oh, he's going in. What? Why you do? Oh, hello. All right, that's fair. Um, although, if you're gonna pull me back, let me actually... I can't land, because I, I, you brought me back too early. Ugh. I may end up changing that ship skill. I don't know. It, it's still gonna be helpful, but... Stop bringing me back! I can't land yet! <laughs> like, I need one of the ones that has the manual land, because I can't actually land myself. It's If I go to the autopilot, it doesn't want to land me. Is it landing? No. So we may have to get rid of this guy or change his ship skill. Because it doesn't want to take me into the landing. See, look, it just keeps recalling me, but it's not landing me. We need a different way to do this. Um, pursue them. Them with all the sticks. Oh, we don't need to hit them with that many sticks. There's not that many of them. Bonk. <sighs> Alright. Uh, we already have the ground fight going on here, right? Yeah, okay. I just wish that the uh, that they made some other way to land, aside from having to kind of the autopilot taking you in. Like, there should be like a retreat. Uh, that well, should be just a landing button or something. Yeah, it's all you, buddy. You can take that junk. All right. Anyway, um, boo, 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 you're in charge. Uh, boss ledge, my nuts. This is gonna be. Um, give me another one. Virilis. I like it. Yeah, like, that's what I was thinking. Some kind of a keybind or something. Uh, I know it's not easy to program that stuff, but Arma in general, though, is pretty sketch. Like a lot of the mechs have very strange parts, and if you like, if you hit the strip button, you'll end up with like weird stuff in your inventory. Like I love it, but it is sketchy. All right, we're liberated here. Let's go grab some more supplies, and. Uh, it's going to be time to mess with the hegemony. We're not right now. What's our marine situation? 600. Alright. 
So we've got this protection. However, the path hates us and the hegemony hates us. Which is to be expected. Uh, Commander, it's steady, but unfortunately, we're good. Damage control and timid. Yeah, I okay, care. Um, we do have room for another officer. One, two, three, four, five. Just push the button and be like, yeah, nine out of ten. But I was kind of hoping to find another special officer. Um, gunnery implants. Yeah, Silver Sword doesn't need system specialization. Uh, you're so reckless. Wow. Let's go ahead and uh, fix that. Be too aggressive. Do stop kamikaze into things. Uh, you're in that. Yeah, so definitely field modulation. Let's go ahead and make that elite while we're at it. Do you have an elite skill? Yeah, you got target analysis elite. Because the EMP gave him target analysis. What are you flying? Oh, you're flying that laser beast. The maneuverability jets. Guess we'll give you ship systems. And then you and the big DACA boy. And you and the other leggy boy. And uh, since I said it, I like it. Uh, yeah, we're gonna... Be a bitchy laser beast. Hmm. <sighs> Oh jeez, what'd you do? It's just gonna be uh it's gonna be appropriate. <laughs> or am I gonna have to ask you what the shape of Italy is? <laughs> yeah, I think we go to Zoo Q Zoo Q. No, I'm like Part of me wants to reach out to the Logic Path and get the the mission, but I also know that there's going to be like no time. The hegemony is going to come after us, but Manticore needs to go down in order for us to stop that. Uh, but it's just those two. But in order to stop the inspections, they need to have no military. There's still quite a few military bases out there. Let's, um, here, let's go to Big Scam real quick. I want to target some specific stuff. You guys. No, you just have administration. Administration. And then they're all level seven. We need a odd one. That's us. One that's like oddly large volume for its size. That's the opposite. <laughs> Bunch of people with ore shortages. I'm not seeing any catalytic converters out there. I thought for sure that some of these colony items were spawning in, but no one's got an unusual amount of production in metal. What about fuel? Thank you, Nightbot, you're the best. Uh, Cedor, actually. Yeah, there we go, Synchrotron Core on Cedor. Where's Cedor at? Yeah, we might go take that. Any others? <laughs> Lost. Lost Dant uh, Dantalion. 
All right, let's go get those because we have plenty of fuel production we could use that for. Lost is going to be the easy one. We already know the hegemony hates us anyway. I think we're looking for D star. Yeah, the D swim. No, that's pear. Is it D swim? No, that's us. It's D swim. Oh, okay. Alright, what are we looking at? Level 6. Gate in the system. We need to get out. Alright, let's pop it over at the comm relay and drop it. Uh, this is going to start the war, though. Um... I kind of want to put that off. Let's put that off if we can. This is a roasty fucking place. Look at this thing. Oh, they saw me. I have some extra fuel. Oh, I ain't got no money. <laughs> oh, would you like some weaponry? Definitely don't need those. Oh, that might be enough to actually just take it. No, it's not. But... Once we... That doesn't matter. Bonk. Lost 90 Marines. That's fine. Give them a good bonk. Wait a couple days. Make sure there's no one coming. Oh, these guys will fight. Fantastic. Uh, security's now high. Um, it was their, uh, they have no preparedness. No, it's just a matter of stability. Okay. Um, already got a supply shortage. Let's hit it harder. 200 marines all right that's fine just wait a week get some more marines back there's a reason why i bonked their stuff so much rebellion on big scam and preparation my fucking ass there is i will dump all of my fucking money in there to stop that hold on i have a operative how can we like do anything about this don't i have an operative i thought i had an operative where are you at what are you doing you're not doing anything i'm home you're a big scam Tell me what the hell's going on there so I can wish this rebellion. All right, wait for more Marines. More Marines are trained. Oh, what are you doing? Shit, delivering Marines, that's not good. Better grab this quick. <laughs> Yoink, <laughs> it's mine. And we get out of here. And we get out of here. See ya. Enjoy them pirates. No, you don't want this. Oh, that's Lego pirates. They do want this. They don't even care. What was the other one? It was, uh... forget. Side door. Clicks. There it is. You fucker. What do you want? Captain Phantasma, the pirate captain, looks almost apologetic on the comms display. This is about the big organic transport operation you're involved in. Ah, say nothing. Do I even need anything? I'll bring in this. They don't have their AI ships. This is just some scrub muffin with... This isn't even a Lego boy. I think he just has Lego ships. Of course, it's one of those. And I'm not a fan of those.
Where are you? Stamina shields are bullshit. Oh, man. roughed up. Where is it? Here, you guys go do your thing. I need to get fixed. Hopefully we don't miss out on the rest of the fight, but I think we will. Yeah, that's gonna be it. What is going on with that shield? Is it disco time? <sighs> I'll chase them down. Hit them with sticks. Bunk. I just bonk a million times, don't mind me. Uh, there is a combo here. Didn't realize that was an independent place. Almost out of debt. Uh, we want to take control of this. Because that will keep... That will take it out of there. They won't get the effects of it anymore. Uh, no, we just want this one. Alright, so we need to get to that. Whack. I maybe lose. Or a hundred. It's not bad. It's not bad for a first whack. So keep an eye on the calm buoy, make sure they don't take it back. Keep their stability down. No, that was a horrible misclick. Just kidding. <laughs> I'm so glad that you can just back out of those. Because that would have been horrible. Yoink. Take that. Thank you. And we're gone. A Lego expedition to Arby's. Apparently being planned on Acorn. I think that's their capital. Yeah. Uh, one fleet raiding the colony spaceports. Alright, we'll just keep an eye on it and intercept it. Alright, next stop. 
There's no plates that we can pick up. There's no... Um, but we can do... Uh, who's got a Nano Forge available? Manticore's obviously got a pristine Nano Forge. All these guys have pristine Nano Forges or corrupt Nano Forges. And is there a weird one? Like an odd man out? Like a lot of... No. So it's just... Hegemony, Kazara, or Hegemony, Persian League. These guys. MRC, yeah, they just have corrupt nano forges. I mean, I guess we could start harassing Manticore and try and take theirs. I might be able to make it happen over time. too far. Alright, what do we got going on? Independent world there. Independent world there. Manticore's over there. Alright. Here's Elspeth. I'm thinking catch me. Oh, because they have that nav buoy out there as well. I'm trying not to do too much out here. They put false readings into a sensor buoy and they don't have one. Rebellion on Big Scam from the Persean League. Okay, so new targets. What's the uh, strength of that rebellion? Government strength, rebel strength. It's my government! God damn it. Alright, um. Do we have any money? We don't have any money, right? Oh, we have a little bit of money. That's cool. Wait, are we out of debt? Did we come out of debt? No. <laughs> Wait, no, 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 we did. We did. We came out of debt, guys. Pop the champagne. Grab the wine. We are officially net positive. All right. I'm just gonna take their pristine nano forge and teach them a lesson. Yeah, but you guys will never stop harassing me about the AI course. And the only way I can solve this is by nuking your shit. So... Why? Alright. Bazimu, or Brazimu, uh, that's where we're going. Autonomia. Um, my guess is if we drop in right here, we're gonna get yelled at, so let's do it. Sup, bitches! Oh, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh, where'd he go? Hey, yo. Alright, um, launch a raid. Let's go break this real quick. Hold on. Oh, are we already done? <laughs> okay. Yoink. That's mine. One, two, three. 
Um, damn, I did it again. Not interested. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, we don't like them anyway. Launch a raid. Uh, we'll take your alpha core. Beige in a big scam. Okay. What's this guy going on? Stealth minefield. Hate that. That thing would probably shit stomp us. Alright. Well, you wanna do that? Uh, where's it coming from? Plan on Maillard Habitat level 5? Oh, what do we get? Um, Most of our officers aren't level 5 yet, but we're getting there, so let's just go ahead and get officer training. And we'll just come over here real quick and end this invasion. Uh, Wait, where the heck is this place? Looking at the map wrong. <laughs> it's in Vecna. Uh, it's the habitats. Right? Hold on. What's this place called? Myriad Habitat. Well, let's go here. There it is. Alright. Where's your calm buoy? I thought for expired. Yeah, these things happen. Uh, smash. Uh, refuse. Get out of my life. Not interested. Get spanked. Uh, that looks a bit spicy. I'm not interested in fighting. Oh, I have to fight it, though. All right, well, let's um, send the patrol HQ. Go ahead and do a save, because I'm worried that this is going to be like an overpowered station. Some of these high, like, like I have really feel like they really cracked these things out. But it might just be the vanilla ones, specifically the ones that are in, like, the stations in High Brossel alone. Yeah, ah, yeah, yeah, purpose. Trying to get blown up, guy. Oh, the Toho has begun. Thank you. We already lost the Spriggan. Alright. Um, let's put all of team two, three, and four, five on that. And we will take care of everything else. Try not to get blown up. I don't know what the hell that is. Oh, it's a Spriggan. Guys, could you like make her go away? What? All right, we really need to help with this. What are you doing? Why are you on the front lines? I told you to. Oh, because you're trying to actually fight. Well, this is nowhere near as bad as I was worrying, but oh, I hate that. I, I don't ever want carriers to go in. That was my fault.
fuck this guy, this gal, this lady, this person. Get toasted. What are you guys doing all the way up in Dagon? That's like a million miles away. What's Dagon habitat anyway? Play level three. You guys aren't allied, are you? Or are two up? Uh, it's just you two. Oh, it's you two. Oh, I don't like that. Anyway, St. Bajan look like clap. Easy. So, nothing in storage. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and shut down this, 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 and this. Freeport. Hey, you guys, official freedoms. Enjoy. <sighs> also, um, you guys want some weapons? Not really. Nor supplies. Okay, I'll give you some weapons. So you do have a rebellion, you know. Oh, that should give you a victory. Um, Actually, here. Just picked up, like, a bunch of supplies, didn't I? No. Uh, not a bunch. Oh, I can give you guys 100 marines. There you go. I, I can make more. I thought I had extra on me. I don't. Take those, and uh, I'm going to have a couple of hundred supplies. That should end this. Rebellion over. Didn't end. Um... I only keep giving them guns, but I can give you another 100 marines, a couple hundred more supplies. Rebellion over. Here's like some more guns, some more supplies, and 500 heckin' marines. End this rebellion. You know what? You're on your own. Oh, Arby's. Damn it. Shit. That's gonna be successful. We didn't get back in time. And now we're blown away off course. Damn it, they succeeded. They have a lot of guys.
Alright. I gotta finish this fight quick. Alright, that's not getting finished quick. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna pause right here. I need to run across the street and pick up Grandpa. And this fight is not gonna end quickly. So, we're gonna have to... I hate stopping in the middle of a fight, but... That's how it be sometimes. So I will... Oh, 15 after. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna aim for for 10 after. So all right, I will be back. Oh, it's gonna be fun.
I could have done that before I started the fight, but these things happen. Okay. Give these Lego bastards something to run home and tell mommy about. Washed them, but I didn't dry them well enough. someone to come out this way. Ooh, ah, ooh, spin me. There we go. Uh, we're doing well. We stole a few pristine nano forages. Or a few Cintricon, Synchrotron cores and a pristine nano forage. Need to go install those, actually. She's level seven. Look at that lunatic. Oh, let's try and protect them. Come on, warp me, warp me. No? Alright, that's fine. Ah! Yeah, I was worried we wouldn't actually be able to take this. Their officers are just too strong, and they've got the demon cores with them. <sighs> Went and waited that whole time just to get shit hammered. Oh, see, this is the problem. Those guys are just so freaking strong. I honestly, like, I did not expect that small of a fleet to give us that much trouble. We're going to need bigger mechs. Mm -hmm. oh, Well, we got the pristine nano forge, but we need to. I guess we're just going to ignore Arby's. Unfortunately, uh, I think our save is going to take us back before the station fight. Yeah. Well, we can win this at least. My lucky charm better work today. I've got plans for a cold beer. And some good company once this battle's done. Blah, 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 blah. He talks a lot. Oh, the Toho is maximum. Let's check out this guy real quick. Ooh, we're getting spun. Thank you. The Spriggins is down.
still been to get there before that shield went back up. done for. Okay. <laughs> really shoot. Nah, it's... The problem with the Armamex is because they're straight craft, any officer with point defense gets bonus damage against us. And so we just got completely blasted. Seven fight. Why eight turns? No. God damn it. There's nothing even left. Shut down. Report. Thank you, Independent. And then I'm just leaving now. Alright. Can't do anything about the Legos. They're gonna whack my port and we're not really gonna be able to stop them anyway. They're too strong. But we can come over here and install some stuff here. Orbital works disrupted. <laughs> ah, they still have rebellion. Um Here's what we'll do. You. Uh, rebellion problem. Take 10,000 or a thousand of these and then like 500 of them and that rebellion. All right, Lux scales on Cyrus path, blah, blah, blah. Uh, speaking of Lux path. Nor. Eleanor. Elnor. Is there a gate near there? No. Well. Let's go visit.
Yeah, the thing is, is uh, we got whacked so hard in that fight that um, no matter how we approach it, I don't think we stand a chance. They have a l massive ship with them. Alright, the normalized atmospheric density on Arby's and rocks and stuff. I don't think there's anything else we can do on those until we get stellar reflectors. Where else did we build? We built atmospheric processors in more places though, didn't we? Oh, they have everything here. So we can do stuff on Arby's. Big scam didn't get either, but we're leaving that the way it is. No, 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 stop. Dirt has a stellar reflector, so dirt we need to play with. Dirt and Arby's. Dirt, Arby's, and Ice Ball. Can't sort by name. Are you kidding me? All right, whatever. Dirt. Um, ah. Oh, we could turn dirt into a water world. Uh, right now. Huh. Or we just improve this stuff. I think we just improve. Uh, let's change it to a Terran world. But, let's go ahead and improve some stuff first. Um, can add volatiles. Improve the farmland. Yeah, let's just improve the farmland first on dirt. Uh, ice ball, normalize atmospheric density. Uh, the other one was. What was the other one? Arby's. Yeah, we can change that completely. Um, oh, we could change it to whatever we wanted. Let's make Arby's a water world. <laughs> or a jungle world. I kinda like the jungle. If I was to change anything else to a water world, what would it be? Maybe rocks and stuff? We have to customize it further. All right, yeah, let's make uh, Arby's a jungle world. Or actually, I kind of like the idea of an arid world, but we'll go jungle world. All right, let's go deal with these buttholes. Rallying on big scam, failed to disrupt fuel production. Oh, I need to have my operative do some stuff. But why she's not in the main list. Thought it automatically put them there. Um You can't do anything from there. Alright, well we can infiltrate the Lytic cell. Nah, let's forget that. Let's just move you to... I don't want to be any at war with uh, the Persian League. Let's see. Let's raise the church. Raise our relations with the church. So you're not useful where you're at right now. Raise relations.
Let me talk to... <clears throat> Is it you? Yeah, I'd like you to leave me the hell alone. Yeah, what's going on? What do you want? On a planet killer weapon. Uh, where do I need to go? Way out in the butthole of nowhere. All right. Uh, there's a den of abominations. Remnant nexus. It's annoying. All right. Give me all your gas. All right, where can we stop along the way? Because we can get there, but I want to be able to actually, you know, come back. Lost. Of course. Uh, Cindria doesn't hate us, right? No, they actually like us. All right, cool. Stop by mute. Is it Cindria? God damn it. What do you. I'm not interested. Oh, what? He didn't take Sphinx yet. Huh. Let's see what's going on here. Good night, Hardnell. Thanks for hanging out. <clears throat> hey, we can join this fight. Get to him in time. Guy, get out. Maximum. did not that's happening this weekend <clears throat> I've got to rearrange some stuff to get the laptop in a permanent position <laughs> and then I gotta redo all my settings on OBS so I wasn't looking forward to doing it <laughs> I'll be doing that over the weekend.
And that should eliminate most of the, uh, the lagging. I say most of, because you'll still see whenever my system lags, but at least the broadcast won't lag any additional. Alright, um, tacky bomb. What's the invasion look like? Oh, uh, let's... Bonk. One, two, three. Did not appear to be anything of value. All right, what's the invasion look like now? That's easy. I only have two units, are you kidding me? Oh no, split. Like, there's so many places you guys gotta go. All right, whatever. Who are you? Raiding, okay. All right, we don't want this one. I'm just here to shut shit down. Downgrade. Freeport. Independent. They now officially liberated. Enjoy. Um, some outrageous prices for supplies, but we need them. I tried to get gas. I get gas here. Can. So I turn my transponder off so I don't get hit further. I already forgot to turn it off the first time. Alright, boom. Uh, oh, also, we should put up some more stuff. Um, Arby's has gotten a little trashed. But we can cut this fuel production now here. Um, but we're going to wait. There's nothing, because I want to put like farming in there and stuff, and they don't have the setup yet. Big scam is fine the way it is, like it. Um, this one is the station mining for volatiles. Might as well have fuel production here as well. Custom Elite. Let's go ahead and upgrade this finally. And we're going to put fuel production here as well as refining. Uh, dirt, you are fine. Uh, let's upgrade your batteries. And Ice Ball. We're going to shut down the refining here because we don't need it anymore. And let's simulator online. And then I think there's some that don't have way stations yet, right? Some of the new ones? Yeah, Dirt doesn't have a way station yet. Uh, Farrah probably doesn't have one yet, right? Uh, let's get out of here. Uh, it's my first day. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're doing great for the for the money. I mean, just look at these beautiful beastie planets. And this is with Ice Ball getting wrecked and Big Scam as a rebellion. And, in fact, uh, it may actually be better to turn off Freeport for now until the rebellion gets settled. And, uh... <clears throat> yeah, we're doing pretty good. And then, like, Arby's got their port wrecked by the freaking Lego boys. We need to start getting stations online. But yeah, no, we're uh, we're doing pause. We're well out of debt. It's lost. Oh, danger high bacon. This is a this is a fat station. I don't know how we're gonna do this. Mm, give it a shot. Oh, there's no one out of the door. That's nice.
I need you to uh, piss off. Thankfully, oof. I was gonna say thankfully it's a small one, but it's not really a small one. <clears throat> oh, give it a shot. Got it by itself. I've got a bottle of the good stuff waiting in my locker for when we return. Yep, Let's yep. Hope we can crack it open tonight. I'm hoping. Where's me? I'm on top of that guy. Get over here. Then we'll have everyone else follow the big guys so that they hopefully don't get destroyed. Try not to let anyone fly out on their own too much. Spriggins is already down. Bunch of guys already down. Zanuck is already down. And you guys are getting way too close. This is the problem is, oh, I can't even see myself. Fuck. Is our carriers are now trying to fight. Everyone's trying to surround this thing. When they should be coming at it head on from one direction. Instead of flying out and around. All right, we're going to cut all the groups. Hopefully get these guys some freedom. I don't think we're going to be able to do this. We're going to need to come back with, with more ships. The problem is those paladins are just going to shred our fighters, and that's the majority of our offense. Lost half our forces. No one can make any openings. And everyone's just charging and getting blown up. We need these big guys to do stuff, but the other big guy got blown up too. All of our big mechs are gone. Like they already got evaporated. Now he's getting destroyed. 
And we didn't even break a single weapon platform. <sighs> well, so much for getting the pathers to leave us alone. At least on the easily. We've got orbital works now. We can start building some of the larger mechs. Maybe we just need to do that. <sighs> yeah, oof. Absolutely. Like, there's nothing we can do to lower that station's, like, combat readiness or anything. Um, well, again, it's the same problem we would have with the Legos, is, uh... Our... Officers are all in... Almost exclusively in ships that count as fighter craft. And those things have six Paladin lasers hooked up to them. Like, there's not much we can do about that. What are you up to? Oh, you're not gonna enjoy it, whatever it is. Good luck. Actually, you know what? There's a gate here. And also, I forgot to consider one more thing that we could look up and potentially take. Uh, where's Big Scam? Uh, food? I know you import it. There it is. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing is, uh, we need to be able to do exactly that. But in order to do that, we need to go get those big guys. Does anyone have soil nanites? Now just a bunch of orbital reflector arrays. Oh, no big deal. Then the other one I was thinking of is light industry. Does anyone have an embryo machine? That one should stand out pretty obviously. In fact, it should stand out from this more than anything. That nah, doesn't look like it. Everyone's producing the normal amount or less. And I don't think there's going to be a big suck out there either. Plentiful volatiles. Just mining. Oh, it's the numbers were the opposite direction anyway. Yeah, no one's got an embry uh a big sucky boy either. Oh. I'm wondering if anyone's got the um fuller and spool. I don't think so. These are just all mega ports. And no one's got the mantle board either, right? And these are all normal numbers. Just rich ore all over the place. Oh, these are consumers, not any producers. Ultra rich or... Ah, 
I figured there'd be more colony items out there. I was looking forward to like pilfering and stuff a little bit more. But it doesn't look like there are. Because all of these are just uh, people being good at mining. All right, um... Where's the uh, gates? Toasted a little bit, but worth it. Go now. Guess we go liberate some people while we wait. Here's some people we can give to the church. Kind of want to ally with them still. They're doing the thing, right? Yeah, okay, good. All right, we can build Xanax. But it's not like they're super durable. Put a couple of those in the fleet, though. So we don't really have much in my way of blueprints. Whoops. Oh, we'll get a couple of them. Yeah, we don't have much of anything to build. Which is fine. We have a few liberated weapons we can put on them. Misclick. This doesn't matter too much. You know, I like that she has voice lines, but I feel like this person. I don't know if it's the acting or the writing, but people don't talk like that with dramatic pauses. Especially when they're not saying anything dramatic. Oh, the lag is really coming through. Am I like... Here, hold on a second. Let's do some quick troubleshooting. What is eating everything up? Steam? Why are you chewing up my resources? Get out of here. Who else has eaten resources? Discord, but that can't be helped. Chrome. All right, that's all that we expected. Hopefully it was just Steam causing this. This isn't that big of a fight for that much lag to happen. Need to do a bit exploring to pick up some uh, blueprints. I'm thinking about it. We don't really have like can't get blueprints here.
We can shut this down. Good. <clears throat> um, I don't want to shut down everything because we do want to give it to them. So I'll just shut down that. Make it a free port. And uh, give it to the church. That's another thing I should think about. Where else are there cryo sanctums out here that we can take? Oh, that's way out there and mute, but we should take that one. This one's only a lang. All right, we should go. Oh, that's the one they're heading towards now. I mean, when they take it over, it's going to have... Uh, they're going to make it... Like, it's going to be illegal for them to, to sell. But if we take it over, we can just completely get rid of it. It's right here, but... we to go in here. Hopefully we can get there before they do... Right, they're there, but... Alright. We aid the attacking force. We will be in that menu. Dawn reporting. All green here. So like, that one was nice and quick. And now we get to invade with a massive amount of dudes all going to three places. I really don't get why it does that. So. <laughs> like sometimes when they feel like you need a lot of units, they don't. All right. So all we're gonna do is shut down the cryo sanctum and hand it back over to Lud. There you go, guys. Enjoy. And now we're gonna go to... What's the other one that I saw? There were a couple others. Hans Command. Way over there at Mute. Where's our gate? Escapadian. Oh, we need uh, resources though. Oh, wow. Oh, uh, they took it back. I thought they had taken it from them. Hey, Laser Guana. We are having a blast. We just found out that we can't take on a derelict port yet. Oh, where's this custom production actually going? Rocks and stuff. Okay. Alright, let's figure out who's going to get upgrades. Uh, you. Oh, you guys are locked in. And you. Oh, hey, yeah. I mean, I'll be all like, woo, 
and then I'll post a community message, but it's not like I'm going to be doing anything huge for it. I recently did a 24 hour stream, so that ain't happening again anytime soon. Um, but yeah, thanks for noticing. I am getting pretty close. Uh, I was expecting it to happen around this month, so that that's where on track for that. Do you really need that good of guns? Just so long as, just so as long as they are a nightmare to try and blow up. Yeah, well, that's what I'm thinking is we might try to make these guys just straight up tank. But the thing is, is they, they act very inappropriately, these guys. All right, so we got her. Ooh, and I can re-mentor her now. Nah, I'm not bothering with that. Uh, 24 hours, probably make it through 10 hour stream. Yeah, I've done a couple of the 24 hour streams for the, uh, one of them was a little impromptu, but the other one was uh, intentional and I kind of like it, it's fun when I'm able to do it. See, I really dislike her skills. We may end up getting rid of her after a while. I don't know. She really needs to get field modulation or I'm gonna be very upset. Oh, no, that's frequent breaks. <laughs> I wouldn't go 24 hours straight. That'd be madness. All right, she is ballistics, so we need to do a retrofit to make her mounts ballistic. Mass ballistic retrofit. All right, give you the storm needler. And I'm thinking a heavy mauler. Actually, part of the problem is all those fighters. Maybe the other guy, you don't have any weapon mastery, do you? No, no, no. So I think the other guy will also do a ballistic and we'll give him the, uh, the, the, the devastator. Devastator and the heavy machine gun. I don't think I'd be able to do any sort of stream without a couple of breaks. Uh, yeah, even even like a five, six hour, I still try to get in like a 10 minute break. Uh, actually, I, I usually do more than one break in that time. But I, I try to take quick breaks, you know, like five, 10 minutes. Uh, but because of um, other responsibilities, I have some breaks that are actually just built in anyway. I'm gonna have to go pick up uh, Grandpa from across the street. Usually that's around the two hour mark and it's a larger break because I you know, need to drive across the street. All right, um, her vent situation is actually not bad. She doesn't really need much of anything except the resistance flux and then support capacitor. You know what? I'm worried though about her actually being able to poop out that much flux at once. Oh, you know what? We have some experimental... Sh no, not some experimental, but some... Don't we have other shield? If maximal shield. So, install a focus lens directly into the shield emitter, which increases shield damage resistance by a factor of three, while being able to fully resist EMP arcing. The lens, of course, reduces the shield arc by half, while slowing the turn rate and unfurling speed. All this is at an increased flux generation cost of 3.5, due to how awful the emitters generate through small magnified lens. We go like that. She's only got 150 arc though, so she better do a good job of pointing her shield forward. Ugh. All right, you got the devastator and the heavy machine gun. You also can do the maximize stabilize. Oh, it's beautiful though. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna go all in on this shield thing. Let's drop the hardened shield because it doesn't actually change much. Put the extended shield on. 
I give you a little bit extra there. Thank you, Nightbot. You're the best. Uh, he just ended up using less of his points on weapons. Um, there's a hardened shield on him, though. Like, on both of them, it's actually... The thing is, is like... It's a small number, but it's actually a really big percentage. But we just don't have the space on her to put throw that on. So we'll put that on him. And for this guy, let's go ahead and do that as well. That maximum shield. So we'll drop the stabilize, insulate. Because he has extra space anyway, because he's got the uh, experimental modifications on. So it's unusual. Maximal shield, common. Harden, extended. He's already got stabilized built in. No, not built in, but ooh, we should build that in. We've got more XP. And you'll be fine. Okay, I wanted to over-engineer her to give better rockets, and we have the space now to do that. How much XP? Yeah, you've got enough for over-engineering. Uh, let's get everyone set up at once. Uh, what do you have? You have over-engineering. Uh, but you're a phase ship, so I can't do much else. So we can build in heavy armor. He doesn't need the mobility. Oops. Why did I just take off? Then there was the red engines. No big deal. Uh, heavy armor. You will just build in stuff when we get there. You... Oh, you guys don't actually have a ton of XP yet, do you? Oh, you actually do. Okay. Let's try and over-engineer. You are already fully over-engineered. I kind of want to give you that maximal shield anyway, though. So let's drop. Safety overrides. And we'll build in the hardened shield. And maybe even the extended shield. How much XP do you have? Only 4,000. It's not going to be enough for both. We'll build in the hardened shield, though. You've stabilized shield over engineer. I don't need to add anything to you. So we can build in that hardened shield on you as well. So I'm sure you have XP, right? Yeah, you've got plenty. You already have over engineer. Build the heavy armor in. Uh, you do not have over engineer, but you also don't have enough XP for it. You do have over engineer and you have enough XP. Probably build in stabilized shields. It's probably the best move for them. What are you? Did you get a lot of XP yet? I don't think that's enough for over engineer on the big guys. We'll try. And then you, you have a ton of XP. You can definitely build an over engineer. Let's take the armor off for a second. Boom. And what about you guys? They're cruisers, so they probably can't. But these guys will be able to build in their stuff will be convenient. Alright. Manage build in whole mods. Let's take care of the civilian ships first. Yes, it is a mech. This is armor. Arma. Which uses uh which has a bunch of cool mechs.
Yeah, they don't have enough. I'd rather hold out so that I can build in the augmented drive field. It's going to be the biggest uh, discount that over engineer built in. Yeah, see, he needs 3,000 for over engineered. So, um, build the AI switch in and save some points at least. Do that for most of these guys. Oh, they don't have enough. Oh, they do have enough. They don't have enough uh, XP to do a story to, to get an extra whole mod though, and do that. But we can build that in on you. Um, actually, probably. Oh, you don't have a shield. <laughs> uh, but you've got a lot of XP, so let's go ahead and over-engineer you as well. I'm going to have to just drop these Spriggans. They're just not performing well. Oh, I already dropped them off the AI. Okay. Ooh. If I over-engineer these guys, suddenly the AI is going to cost way too much. We're already at 143. I think I'm just going to drop this Alest guy. Or maybe I drop the Einhander. Because I already have an Einhander, and I just need to start bringing him with me instead of bringing that guy. That'll save us enough points that once we over-engineer the rest, it won't be as much of a problem. Because uh, over-engineering will um, increase their deployment cost. Oh, you don't have enough. You will if I refund that. I really just don't want to mess with the Spriggans. They're just there to like clog the battlefield up. Uh, stabilize shields. Uh, you can get stabilized shields as well. You already have over engineering stabilized shields, but we could build in something else because you have a ton of XP. Uh, shield conversion front gives reduces the damage to shields even more. Hardened shields is going to give us. Here, let's. Yes. Uh, hardened shields. Uh, why did it take me out of the menu? Just got more points. Oh, not enough points for that, though. You. Already have auxiliary generator. And over engineering. So let's build in the hardened shields. You don't have enough for over engineering. Oh, right. The LS takes a lot. Forgot about that. Um, we're building the AI switch for now. Uh, build that heavy armor in. Same story. You still don't have enough for over engineering. Ah, it's 8,000 for that thing. I mean, yeah. It makes sense. It's it's super good. I should have built the stabilized shields. What am I doing? I have enough to extra. Uh, we'll take the high sky amplifier off and put stabilized shields on.
I have room. Could put the maximal shield on ourselves as well. I think the maximal shield is just busted. I think we just go all in on that thing. Thing is, then I don't have enough energy to actually do anything. If I take off the extended shield. I mean, that's, not, that's, not, that's not that bad. How is this? I think we're just gonna try it. We're not really getting surrounded in this fight. It's just getting beat up on. Uh, I don't remember what I had on you. Oh, I guess we could. Let me maximize her shield. And she does have XP. Change these later. Fact. I can drop this and pick up the extended shield, which I didn't put on. Why didn't I put on extended shield? Uh, I don't have the space for it, that's why. Uh, hold on, where is it? There it is. I am just a walking Tachyon Lance at this point. <laughs> uh, maximal Shield, that's what it was. That is, that is my life. That is what we are. A walking Tachyon Lance. With that thick-ass shield. Alright. We got the heavy armor because you're a phase ship. Um, let's give you the resistant flux card. And uh, I really need to get automated repair. So often that I don't have that when I want it. All right, you got the heavy armor. You already got reinforced bulkheads. And then blah, blah, blah. I don't think those affect the fighters. Let's just. Oh, I remember. All right, all right. Oh, you had split chamber, didn't you? For the Juno and the Glaive. Yeah, split chamber, anti armor. All right, you got. You didn't get over engineer, unfortunately. I think this one was safety overrides. I don't remember. No, probably not, because it's got all the ranged weapons. I think it was just built up the vents. And then we can harden the shields a little bit. And then you hardened your shields. Uh, you had the safety overrides. 
Yeah, that's where all your energy went. And you also had safety overrides. Then you. Maximal shields, maximal shields, maximal shields. I'm gonna try it on everyone. Hopefully it works out. I think it will. This thing, like, reading it, it's a little ridiculous. We haven't done anything with this guy. What is this? Expanded face capacitors. All right, it's just a slight change, but we don't need that. I mean, I don't, you do your job. I don't need you, any, I don't need anything else going on there. All right, we over-engineered you though. I guess we just put heavy and front-loaded armor on them. Don't turn your back on the enemy. Or they will clap your cheeks in half. Can you fire that heavy needler? Barely. How about that thing? Can you fire that thing? Oh yeah, easily. Okay. That's all green. Uh, front loaded armor, reinforced bulkheads. And you're also over engineered now. I feel like these guys without shields are just going to become liabilities in the long run. We may end up having to cut them as much as I love them. They've been with us for a while. But if they can't, you know, they can't fight, they can't fight. Try going on split chamber. I also need to get some voltage enhancers. Uh, so I can buff the damage after I nerf it with a split chamber, because that's that's the gimmick, is you use split chamber to increase the fire rate, and then you buff the damage significantly. Um, I'll leave the Devastator Cannon on him, I think it's funny. Just need to build in some more stuff when we get the chance. Alright, you weren't able to get over engineering, but... Shield... Stabilize, harden, extend. Ooh, I feel like you were safety overrides. You were, weren't you? Boom. The drop split chamber then. Oh, I could block. Drop more than that. Harden shields then. Not oh, harden shields. Do your best, buddy. I believe in you. He's gone. All right, we got two slots to work with. I'm thinking to drop these. Oh, I need to save. And turn on the skill. Medium, medium. Converter. I'm thinking Vulcans. Bumpers, I mean. And then we try and maximal his shield. He's got such a small shield arc already. But that's fine. So we're going to extend it. 
And then we're going to cry because it doesn't extend that far. But back to heavy armor and the front loaded armor. Oh. Take off the hardened shields. Add some more vents. Yeah, because you don't you just need to be able to fire those two thumpers. Can you do that? Oh yeah, easily. Okay. But what about the gall? Oh yeah, that's no big deal. Okay. Oh, that's a goal. Oh, where are we putting this, uh, okay, yeah, building that. Okay, there we go. I need to find more operatives. Alright, so we're gonna go back and do this fight. Probably need extra supplies. I think this is the best we can do. I kinda wanna get some more of the, the wider mechs still. Thing about them though is they're less interesting because they don't they have a lot of um, built-in stuff. So you really can't customize them all that much. Okay, let's go back. Try this station fight again. Hey nerds, I don't want none of this. My fleet is too large. Yeah, well your fleet's kind of crummy anyway. I'm just gonna do flips and shit and get out of here. See you, nerds. Spicy boys. Come look at me. Hey, how you doing? Oh, they didn't work at all. Only crisis upcoming hedge in the end, especially during Barrelis. Well, you got time. I need to get these fleets away from this thing, though. Mm. 
Damn it, they saw me. Please fire, accept. Um, I mean, we are opening up a simulator, but no, it's we also have uh, we have some boys in charge. <laughs> Just a few little guys. They're not a problem. They ain't hurting nobody. Alright. We can bring everyone. Everybody follow all of them until we get close. Inbound for combat range. Keep your eyes on the scope. This guy's gonna YOLO slam his face right into that base. So we better be ready to support him. Uh huh. I guess we can't actually do anything about this. Look at him go! YOLO Commando! I'm gonna try and... Soak up some of this fire for him. Alright. You guys need encouragement. That. Alright. The gas shields. I guess I have no room to talk anymore about the gas shields. Alligator's getting wrecked. He's just not doing. Oh, we caught a few paladin shots. Oh, over here, over here, over here. We got in, but we didn't get any EMP off. Guy, what are you doing? Oh, you're stalled out. Well, he's gone. What are you up to? Try and draw fire off of them. But you need to... Oh shit, you need to really back up and, like, fix yourself, though. Like, what are you doing? Oh, you got no engines now. I'm trying to get in there and help them. Oh, I got flamed out. Protect me, mommy. Warp me back. Oh, never mind. We're good. Mama ship didn't need to save me. Dude, she's already shredded. It's just not working out even with that. Like, the problem is they're spreading out, so like the entire station is getting to fight. Like, I don't know if there's any way we can have them like stick to one side so they can cover each other a little better. Because I can't even get in when when there's not other ships there. And neither can anyone else, so it's like they're just suiciding against the thing. Look at all that fire. Oof. Alright. I need to come back. But I don't I don't think this is doing any better than before.
is a little bit better. Maybe if I had positioned them at the start, we'd be doing all right. Like, maybe if we just pulled them all to the side. Yeah, that's the thing. You can't really micromanage this. You don't... It's like... But apparently that weapon grouping did change them up a little bit. It's just like... I need the big guys to go in. But if I tell them to go in, they'll go in too hard. See, they're, they're flying way too far back. And then all the little ones who are supposed to be with them and not, like, flying out and getting shot at randomly are doing exactly that. Like, look at that guy. That guy had no reason to charge in like that. I'm over here trying to draw fire off of him. It's just not working. All right. Well. You see? And you guys. Stop. I'm over here, too. Like, everything is just flying off on its own and allowing the station to just attack too much. Like, we need everyone to stay in a specific spot. I'm surprised she's still intact. I mean, it's working, but maybe, maybe we'll need to restart and organize them from the start. I didn't need that. I guess I didn't need that. But you need even more. Get the hell out of here. Alright. Ah, see? You're not on the point. Like you should be. Please don't blow up. Please don't blow up. Please don't blow up. I'm inside you. Please don't blow up. All right. We need to bring the these guys even further back because that's not good. Try and soak up fire for them. Um, yeah, but the problem is, is that this thing's, um, what do you call it? Peak readiness is like hours. It's not hours, but it's way longer than all of ours. Stop! No! Why are you bringing me back? Stop that shit! Now it's just gonna keep retracting me because my combat readiness is low. But it's like, I can only recover so much combat readiness. Yeah, see, I need to cut that system. I don't want to, though. Like, it's a good system, it's just... It bugs out for this situation, like... Because it's like, oh, you need to be refitted. But it's like, I don't. I mean, I do, but it's not like you can do anything for me at this point. I mean, maybe the fighters will win eventually, but I'm worried the combat readiness on our destroyers is going to go down before we able, we're able to take care of this. Alright, my combat readiness is already degraded, so please leave me alone. Shit. Uh, no one's coming in, so I'm wasting my five seconds that I've got before mommy even zaps me back. And there goes the lady. Yeah, maybe if we pull them back like that first, then we'll have a chance. Because, like, right now, I can actually get in here and start shutting shit down. But I need to actually be able to do it, but I can't without any covering fire. Like, I need stuff to go in. And not my little guys. I need the big guys to be able to go in. But, like, for once, they're just backing up and going back in before they fully recharge. Like, they're not playing smart. And I'm just going to keep getting warped back. Oh, unless I get Paladin blasted. Please, please warp me back. Please warp me back. Please warp me back. I want it now.
Yeah, the destroyer's combat readiness is starting to go down. We missed our window to be able to win this. And with the uh, their fighters coming back, the fighters can shoot behind our shields. So like... Oh, you're a lunatic. I don't think there's any way we get this part, but there is, I think there's a path to victory here. Oh my God, the repair is taking forever. What is going on? I'm surprised that Spring is still able to do anything. Oh well, it was able to do anything. Like, why aren't the fighters going in? Hold on. Get the fighter strike and hopefully that'll help. All right, all right, all right, come on. I don't have long before mommy zaps me back. Let's go. Get in here. Oh shit, why am I weapon on auto fire? Please have zapped somebody else back. There. <laughs> uh, no, I need to be able to fight. Zap someone else back. Like that needs to get turned down. Uh, all right, we need to start this fight over. I literally can't do anything while that thing is doing that. Like it's a great skill. And it's really cool that they'll use it on the Armamex. But like it that it pulls you back, but it like either our either combat readiness time needs to be like recovered a little bit or it needs to recover more combat readiness in that like or that bar needs to go lower. Something needs to change because I literally get no time to actually fight. But I don't know where to even begin to look that up. I think that's I think that's actually the vanilla game because the um I think it's probably based on the Astrals ability to recall fighters. I don't know. It's really nice, but it's really bad at the same time. Because we get situations like that. All right. I think if though if we bring everyone to the same side at the start, we might have enough focused fire before people go down. Uh, Jim, anyone in another alliance office offer? Oh, we gotta wait. Damn it. Messed up. Because I forgot that when you disengage like that, it uses combat readiness. Oh, you were just about to leave, too. <sighs> Except. Damn it, they really messed up my positioning. So it took me a second to be able to correct it. Alright, back in. Everyone go. I want you closer, and then all you guys. Hopefully this will work. All green here. I wish I could drag and move that. So now I gotta get in here and reselect all these guys. Put it up here. Have fun, man. I'll see you around. I'll be here for a couple more hours at least. Like, yeah, they see this pulling off to the side is unacceptable. That's a problem, because then you're opening yourself up to more fire from the station. Alright, I just need to make you guys an emergency group real quick.
and he can't prioritize the station and the fighters in that first volley, so it's like, you're gonna take unnecessary damage. Don't do that. Alright. Why are you doing that? See, like, they, they keep doing it. They just pull off to the side like that. I should, honestly, I should probably tell the flagellator to stay back with these guys and then cut them loose later. When the station's a little on the weaker side. Oh, look at those guys getting hammered. to get a little closer. Oh, no! I don't know what happened right there. Fucking A. Like, did I accidentally put myself in group 10 or something? Because I came out and my shield was down and I was getting blasted. Hate how stuff like that pops up in front of you. All right, we'll save here, so I don't have to do any of that over again. And when we get in here, you, 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 and you are control group zero. And we already have five. We're gonna put you in five. We'll call that nine. So zero and nine are set. And actually I'm gonna put you in nine as well. Because so you can go from a distance and do your thing. Alright. Boy everyone. I've got a bottle of the good stuff waiting in my locker for when we return. I might just go back and get a couple extra of the larger mix. If this is really not possible right now. Oh my god, I completely forgot to rein them in. Alright, 9, go here. 10, go here. She's trying to silver sword in. Oh, you really need to not be there, guy. That's a bad spot. Sorry for the lag, the fighters do that. Why is the afflictor so far up front? I told it to go back with the other group.
I don't know who's that getting lit up, but they're gone. I think it was a regular fighter. You're way off to the side, buddy. That's not a good spot to be in. Literally, the whole station focuses you. I'm curious about something. It doesn't. The enemy fighters can get me, but the station itself, oh, the squalls can still target me. But the station itself can't target me there. Thank you. Not with the Tachyon Lance. Maybe with an Ion Pulsar I could pull that off, but not with the Tachyon Lance. It doesn't have enough EMP arcing. Oh, I got lanced by the high intensity laser. Revenge. Ooh. A little bit of it there, too. Red guy already gone? I think so. I want to get the struts down, and then I think at that point we'll do better. Thank you. No! Damn it! I need that thing to stop doing that to me. And it's gonna keep doing it. somebody else ah. couldn't wait one more second alright 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 next one I have to repair but Try and get one more lance in. Why are you guys moving around the thing again? That's the opposite of what I said to do. All 
All right, mommy, I need the, uh, thank you. <laughs> I don't want to cut him loose yet. We will eventually, but not yet. I need to get a squall on that heron. Let's go. Alright, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Please don't warp me back yet. That's fine. That's fine. I'm kind of counting on it now. No, no, no. Go for it. 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 I need cover. Speaking of cover. No! That's alright. That's alright. That's alright. You. Uh, how do I negate your order, though? Let's do that. Let me just put you guys back there. Oh, hello. How you doing? All right. Let's go in, buddy. You and me. I have the tiger. Uh, kind of expecting mommy to warp me back right now. Uh, is she doing okay? She didn't blow up, did she? Uh, my engines are going down though. I need repairs. Alright. Um, let's cut you guys loose as well. Maybe you'll be responsible. Maybe not. I don't know. I mean, like, go in. We can't have him up there by himself. Their squalls are down, so it should really make the, the difference. Oh, I'm on autopilot. Right. Alright. I think we have it. here until mommy pulls us back. Oh, hi. Oh, 
he's going all in on that. So close. Send the fighters in. Why are you, like, not sending in the fighters? I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Come on. Need to get out there. They're doing that thing. Lucky my laser can't hit you. <laughs> Goddamn thing hiding up under that shield. I just can't get to it. Literally. Everybody, cut loose. Try and fight. <clears throat> we just need to surround the damn thing. Get this shield out of our way. Function. I need the warp. I need the warp. I need the warp. Is she out there? I need the warp. I need you guys to come up closer, actually. Because we need we need more weapons fire. Do we have anything else with guns on it? No, I mean like go in. Like even she doesn't want to repair. Nobody wants to repair. Don't have any kinetic weapons. Da! Go in! Why aren't you firing your fighters? You, you fuck it. I don't know what else to say. Send your fucking fighters into combat. That's literally the reason we're losing. And then it doesn't help if you bring me back when the fighters need my support. you why aren't they sending their fighters in oh <laughs> 
<laughs> he opened it up. <laughs> Damn it. <sighs> it. He opened it up, though. I didn't realize you could blast those parts off. All right, if we can get repaired one more time before this thing blows up, we should be able to do this. Because now I can get in on the side there. But what drives me crazy, like, now they're actually sending their fighters in. Go, 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 I can, I can make that gap. <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> as frustrating as it was, shout out to Mommy, MVP, the Harpy. <laughs> Oh, she's the only reason we had this many of the mechs still in the fight. Well, uh, because she was warping them back. I got I, there's o I can only have one of these. If I had two of those in the fleet, they would literally be nonstop warping me to each other. It'd be hilarious. Oh. Okay. Oh. Oh, so we got a new AI core. That's part of the problem. I have safety overrides on, so my combat readiness degrades faster. But this will help stop that. Is hardened subsystems actually slow combat degrading? It does. So we need to get hardened subsystems as well. But those uh, thick shields. Look at all these burnt pieces of toast. Slag City. Another one! At Arby's this time. Gee, I wonder who that was. Alright, we need to find more... Uh, more operatives. This ain't happening. This is not happening. Look, if you guys weren't about to AI inspect my butthole open... I might have considered, no, I wouldn't have considered it, because I know they're eventually going to do it. Uh, but no, we need to... We need to mess it up. We're going to need to... Make sure the hegemony has no function in military bases, probably. Which is... <sighs> going to mean a stealth minefield. Not looking forward to that. But if we can take on the AI station, we might be able to take on full Star Fortress. Because honestly, I'm less scared of the Star Fortress than I am of those AI stations. So far out there. We're low on supplies. Not too low, though. We wouldn't be able to survive another big fight, though. Alright, I'm gonna go to the restroom. Have a quick smoke.
while I figure out which direction we're heading. Because we either need to head back and prepare for the hegemony, or we need to go out there and acquire the planet killer. So I will be back in less than 10 minutes, hopefully. Here, let's look at, uh, look at Arby's. <laughs> oh! Oh my god, that fight.
Bus. Oh, I'm back. Thanks for waiting. So, we have two cycles. It's going to be until the end of May, and then the end of June, when it'll trigger. It'll take time before it launches. That's enough time for us to go and get the Planet Killer. And more importantly, return with some added bulk to our fleet. I don't think we'll need them to take the hegemony. I think we could potentially do that with what we've got right now. But it'll be even better if we have them with us. <clears throat> We shouldn't need to stress this too much. I just need who is damaged. You're damaged. We can't have that. It's way too slow. We, we're not low on crew right now. We have plenty of crew. It's a small group. We should be fine. Really? Back in Dawn just got blasted. Oh, there's another eagle out here. Shit, I didn't even see that.
Yeah, which one? <laughs> Circle strafing maniac sounds like me. I, I, like, you mean the one with the taser? Like, we got quite a few circle strafing maniacs. Just hoping for the, uh, the Dominator. Advanced optics, integrated targeting, advanced turret gyros. Don't work with that, though. <clears throat> the only problem is we're not going to be able to fix these guys. What's wrong with you? Faulty power grid, damage weapon mount, structural damage. It's not that bad. Graded engines, faulty power grid, structural damage. Could be worse. Compromise all unreliable subsystems. Structural damage, not a problem. Heavy armor, armored weapon mounts. Integrated targeting. Expanded missile racks, integrated targeting, heavy armor. Wired one PK monster. <clears throat> some repairs but actually we'll be able to jump back so not a big deal rebellion a big scam though is uh causing problems <clears throat> let me go there first i mean that's where we need to go anyway We have more at home.
Don't have extended magazine yet. Wow. Oh. We don't have the weapons for him though. Damn it. not at all how I want this guy to look. You know, just crack shields all day long, or crack armor. <sighs> Until we can get the better stuff on him. What is that thing system? 
Guardian Protocol. Uh, disables shields and stuff. I don't know if I want him using that all the time. Um, did we do a ballistics on him? I, he's got the Mjolnir. I mean, once we get him to the point where he can uh, over-engineer, we're going to put more missiles on him. So... in a month. Ugh, can't get out there that fast. Maybe I can. I have your planet, Boomer. <clears throat> it's a shame we almost got here in time to delay it a little bit longer. But we knew it was going to happen anyway. Let's look at it's time to return to base and properly outfit everyone. Um... getting disrupted now. Yeah, our boy is in charge. That's not home. Home is next door. hire one of the Spriggans.
Just realized I don't have any uh, <laughs> ion beams. This is what I wanted to put on them. Phase lances are fine. on lances either. This is alright. <clears throat> oh, you also need... Red engines. have a military base here yet? Troll H, that's our own place. No, so we need to start setting up military base somewhere. I have just the place in mind. Do I have machines on me? I do. how it says Ludic Church is not going to be happy. Well, the Ludic Church wants to sass me in my own system. Let them try. It will be the last thing they do. I can't do it until it's actually finished. Okay, that's fine. We'll wait. Pocket. I like it. That'll confuse me less. We're going in. This one's on me. Ah, oh, good. <laughs> we have plenty of light industry around. I'm gonna build another military base here. Oh, you know, no, that's already upgrading. Uh, let's also upgrade this. That's what we need to do. Mega port there. Wow, you're making a ton of cash, buddy. Great job. Didn't even have all your industry up yet. Fantastic. Um. Everyone else has a way station, right? 
Oh wait. The... I spawn as a way station. Minos does not have a way station. Minos is also doing a great job. We're gonna put the uh, domain architecture there for more access to that. Uh, I keep clicking dirt. I keep not looking. Everyone else is a waste station. All right, we'll just hold on to that last bit of cash. Uh, we did everything here. Oh, no, we didn't. Hey, you. Uh, didn't we have a rebellion here? Hold up. Oh, there was rebellions. Arby's has the rebellion. Hey, yo! Please take these supplies. All these guns. And all these marines. And uh, I don't want to hear nothing about this rebellion anymore. Traveling. is talk about drinking raw. Oh. Man, that's some uh, advanced maneuvers you got going on there. my engines. They're okay though. See you nerds. Oh, mistake. Mistake. I'm gonna take those maximized shields off. They're only really super useful against uh, something we can all face forward, but in a fleet fight like this, they're just gonna get everyone killed. Caught that one in the mouth. Do your thing, guy. I gave you that phase teleporter for a reason. Do your thing. Oh, hi. Yes, mommy. Although. I gotta say, uh, 
The AI doesn't think I need to go heal, so uh, thanks for taking me all the way away from the fight. And you did it again. Can you go away? What did I even give you that phase teleporter for? Wow. Great job. Alright, we're taking that away from them. Let's give them a regular burn drive. Oh, hello. Maybe we leave it on them. That was a pretty good repositioning. Maybe the range is different on different ships. Ah, they got away. Which is fine, because we're going to chase him down and hit him with sticks. Uh, bonk. I don't want your trash. You can keep it. Bonk. Alright, well that puts that off for a while. Good night, Matthew. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, no, 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 no. Rebellion problem. Fucking nerds. <laughs> That'll do it. Well, go back to our traditional money making ways. We've got some derelict places left. A couple over here in Yaw. There's one in Hamos. We'll do that one. Those are all independent now. There's some over here too. Still quite a few left. 
Let's liberate them before the uh, AI captures them. Damn it. Disrupted fuel production again. Rebellion and the Arby's failed. Government victory. Ooh, I need uh, more troops. guns. Do you guys have guns that I can take? They do.
Uh, Arby's was going to become a jungle type, and it is becoming a jungle type. Okay. All right. <clears throat> I just need to go home and pick up stuff. Wait, Cassadar? What? Lethia wasn't there for... I looked for Lethia, it wasn't there! When did Lethia show up? Well, there's not a gate there, but... Maybe there is a gate there, and it just doesn't give it to you with scanning those gates anymore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I forgot to clear out the... Fuel additives. Oh, goodness. Is it unusual, or is it just get put in the regular ones? It's not Ash. I mean, oh, it's this one. Yeah, fuel additives. Boom! Oh, now you can have a little bit more actual capacitor. This fuel additives will boost it by just one per point. Which is all we need on these. Fortunately, these guys aren't going to be able to make use of that. We put fuel additives in them, it's going to drop down to an 8. So, that's fine. They're already pretty buff on their own. Particle accelerator, nice. I need to start grabbing hall mods whenever I see them. Alright. Oh, I also need to check the bar for shady people because we only have one operative. Speaking of, repeat last mission. Keep that Ludic Church on my side, even though we're actually. <laughs> I should be honest and uh, change my diplomatic profile. Uh, where is diplomatic profile? Mine. Uh, we are pretty technocratic and militaristic. Um, yeah, there we go. It's a small one, but... I should be bringing in specifically 
the ships that need XP, which is going to be you two. Uh, I'm pretty much writing these guys off. It's going to take so many points to be able to upgrade them further. Um, but these guys will be able to upgrade at some point. I don't know why I'm bringing in so many troops. I don't need this much. I just want to end it quickly. Watch out for those salamanders, so they hit me in the booty. <laughs> nice job, you phased in facing the wrong way. Where'd you go now? Oh, you need auxiliary thrusters on you, don't you? Um, I mean, if we get best of the best, it'll make it a little bit cheaper. Keep free and turn on Freeport. I also need to remember to shut down all these industry. Uh, we'll leave the farming. didn't want it. Nothing exciting. Uh, we're out of debt again now. Uh, we'll leave this the one they, the way it is because we're going to send it over to the LUDs. Oh, damn it. I'll go back. There might be something in storage there. Yep. Uh, any shitty people? No. It was this one. Should be fine here. Estella. Oh, Memorial Beacon. It's Estella, anyway. Oh, Jeebus. That thing. Well, would have been cute. But we, uh, I don't want that now. Um, yeah, let's just fight. We're fine. We got so much crap to throw at them. I'm really thinking I might need it to. Lucky charm better work today. I've got plans for a cold beer and some good company once this battle's done. There's just so many words there. Just, I got plans for a cold beer, it's fine.
It's almost like she forgot the other part and then had to mention it. And oh yeah, not drinking alone. Even better, which is great. But it feels like it was an afterthought. All right, let's go over here and tase up this guy. Yeah, we gotta take that phase teleporter away. I don't know. Maybe we'll keep the phase teleporter, but we gotta we gotta change up the. Uh, we gotta give them um, auxiliary thrusters and helmsmanship. Just want to take a moment and appreciate the classic chop of this thing, the classic lollipop chop, where this side and this side are the only things remaining. <laughs> Who blew up? I think that was one of the fighters. More timid officers. This will be two. Two rounds. Got vast ruins, I almost want to keep it. We're fine, we don't need vast ruins. that you know. all right we just need to clear out this sector you wanna yeah <laughs> there we go Forward to sharing 
sharing a round of drinks with you all. Once we've dusted off from this battle. Does that mean a shower? I hope that means a shower. Oh, the yellow slam. Hey, it's Murder Base! I forgot about Murder Base. I don't think we'll need to stress it. We just go in. We're going in as well. What's the enemy status? Uh, they're down with the thickness. Damn it! He fired the hammer off right as I destroyed it. I wanted to protect our boy. I kind of want to pick up one of the blocky boys just for the fun of it. Oh, 
actually. Let me get that Devastator. Oh, I got plenty. Monthly income, 700,000. Oh, I'm not used to this much freaking money. to start buying up weapons i know i have like a big gap in certain kinds of weapons so speaking of gaps in weaponry now i don't think there's any ships i want Oh, I am way wrong. There's a four ships I want. Uh, All right, three of these with Marines are going to give me... I think it's 150. Hold on. I want to do some math real quick and make sure that I can actually, like... I want to support all the... Ground support all the Marines I get. So we have five ships to get rid of. So I kind of want to keep the salvage rig. <clears throat> oh... We have big stick bug as well. I really want to get rid of big stick bug. All right, so that's a hundred. That's a hundred. We get two revenants and two fa phantoms. I think that's just what we're gonna do: is just two revenants, and two phantoms, and just be done with that. Yeah, because we're gonna keep stick bug and horgno. So far, you know what? Let's get the alt graves as well and retire the extra Xanax we have. That way we've got all unique mechs. That one's got they both have karma. But they're slightly different. Already have a watchdog. Let's get a Garriga. And where's the other one? I think the other one's Tritachion. Uh Yeah, this one we already have one of. No, we don't have one of these. Xanak EX? We don't have a Xanak EX. Alright, which alt grave do I want? Not this one. I don't want Wincom. So we'll drop the C. We'll get the Xanak EX. What the heck is this? Grab one of those. Shouldn't be obtainable. Okay. Then we won't. Is this one shouldn't be attainable as well? No, that one's okay. Oh, it might be buggy, so I don't want to pick it up. Oh, we can get by Exapicos? I like Exapicos. 
Alright. I don't think there's any other mechs hiding anywhere else. Spatial jaunt. That's cute. I'll have to hunt one of those down in a future playthrough. I really like Rankies. But we're pretty much stock full on everything we're going to get. All right. Um, we have all the mechs as well. We have a couple of these back at the base, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, weapons. I don't have a Shivan Destructor. I also don't have one of those. But there's one thing that I don't have that I really want. And I better... Well, actually, we uh, we need a couple of those as well. Speaking of things I don't really want. <laughs> uh, uh, where the hell is it? I'm not seeing it. What the hex? Ah, there it is. Overcharge fusion torch. Give me all of them. All right. Good to go. What do you want? I mean, we literally just decided we're getting rid of one of these. But I don't want to sell. I'll hold on to it. Uh, not interested. Did we liberate this whole system? Independent, 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 pirates. <clears throat> you know, let's go off this assumption that the pirates were doing a wonderful job keeping these people alive, even if they're awful. We should go to clicks next. Just to shut down any more hegemony expansion. Ooh, Hispaniola. That would be a great forward operation base to take out these guys. How much time do we have? Let's go to Hispaniola. I might keep that one. Do I have another AI core on me? I don't. Let's head home real quick. See if we can pick up an AI core and some extra supplies. We should be able to take on Hispaniola. God, I'm good at flying. I just sort of blindly flew over here. <laughs> it's just like, I kind of know where I'm at. Humble brag is not humble. Also, I want to upgrade this. Are you still a rebellion? You do. Damn it. Uh, So heckin' annoying. Like, look how much money they, they're they not bringing in now. They were bringing in so much more. Oh well. Not interested. 
Uh, oh, AI core. We can't burn AI core. Also, all of our stuff is still going to the wrong spot. It needs to go to custom elite. Please tell me you got a big alpha core for me. Nice. Actually, that'll be... Alright. Actually, I'll bring that. Oh, my prisoners. Don't want to lose them. They're coming with us. <laughs> we always bring the prisoners on away missions. What do you want? Whatever. Actually, you know what? You need plumbers. I can't afford yet. Oh, no, it's not put domain archaeology here. As we, you know, we don't need the mining. I'll shut down the mining. Put domain archaeology. I will put commerce when we get the chance. Definitely don't need the mining there. Also, also, also. Jungle type is improving. I don't have anyone else that can improve right now. Scoping out for potential military base. So we're going to want to expand further into this area. Once it's set up. We're going in. We're going in as well. What's the enemy status? Like that. We're going in as well. You damn well better.
Oh, Rogue Reaper. Big bada boom. Who got away? Whatever. Yeet. Can we do it without the uh, tactical bombardment? No, we cannot. In fact, uh, no, no, we, we're fine here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, God. Split. 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 Yeah, look at that. There's nothing there. Get in. Crush. Still 30% faster. I think we grab this anyway. Up four hearts. <laughs> Alright, uh, I don't want to be in charge. Here you go. No, oh, we're in charge of Hot Pocket. That's a problem. Ah, it'll be fine. Ice ball and hot pocket. Because we're hot and we're cold. Alright, um. Upgrade that right away. Uh, it's disrupted. Weights. Uh, sorry to make a port. Let's put a way station in place. Uh, this is big hot, but we can put an atmospheric processor in place as well. Let's do the atmospheric processor first. We'll do the way station. <clears throat> I would like you to leave. Psycho. I'm gonna have to take him out of the out of the uh, the mix because he just ends up running through and dying all the time. I mean, he's a good distraction though. He hasn't died all the time because I haven't been recovering him all the time. Just caught him on a bad day. <laughs> That guy, on the other hand, he stays forever. I forget how we got that. Did we buy that or did we like, I think it was like the first one we bought and we were able to recover it. And I was just like, yeah, okay. You don't live here anymore. Go away. You need to go away too. Um, 
They still really don't like us. But I'm trying to put it off. I know it needs to be done, but I don't want to do it. I also want to, at some point, keep messing around with these other contacts. Get some more cool stuff from them, maybe. This guy, though. Maybe? I mean, he's a high contact. <laughs> it's high. <laughs> contact high. <sighs> Lycus doesn't have a gate. But then again, it's not super important that it does, because we can go always warp into Oberon. That's usually safe because it's right, the gate's right under the star and none of their uh, bases are there. All right. What's going on down here? These have all been cleared up. That was a proper expansion over there. These are all cleared up. I think there's very few derelicts left. Just, maybe is it just clicks? Nah, Zoo Q as well. Summon Dagon as well. One in Vecna. Alright. Let's make it happen. We got a little bit of time left. Let's finish the derelicts. Thanks, guy. You're the best. Clicks is going after Clicks command, so that's where we're gonna go first. Let's pack the hegemony. We'll go transponder on. I can't help but notice you're engaged in battle here. Would you like some support? Through this menu. <laughs> uh, team one, team two. Uh, are you expecting me to do all this? And it's really looking like it. Team 4, Team 10, Team Y, U. Where's your troops, guy? Are you gonna end up doing this, or...? Oh. I mean, it's just a station. Calm down. Fade. <laughs> uh, they got nothing going on. Yoink! It's mine now. Nope, you don't get it. It's mine. Oh, cancel. <sighs> you know, we don't really need money anymore. So, I'm just going to give these up to the independents, as is. Actually, I'm going to give these guys. It was originally MRC. Well, they belong. Of course, that's, uh... They're probably going to just take that back. Estral and red water. Let's go there. Ooh, I accidentally took too much crap. Uh, yeet. Yeah, let's get this one some more XP. Going in as well. What's the enemy status? You better be going in as well. I told you to.
Who did this originally belong to? MRC as well? Well, you know what. Another alliance office offer from the hegemony. They have no idea. Custom order delivered to murder base. Nice. Pick that up on the way back. Uh, can we just invade? Yes, we can. Uh, what is that? Class? That doesn't say. Right. So I'll just remember, stop by murder base on the way back. It's fine. Uh, originally by the dictators. Um, yeah, sure. supplies um what's our next target again no there was another one on the way over it was like one of these wasn't it zuku and dagon all right um hope we can pick stuff up over at that pirate base Of those, but whatever. Gaudi person, what do you want? Experimental frigate. Not interested. Too cute. Station. Hyper shunt tap. Pirate blueprints. Hey, how you doing? Welcome back. Eco OM. What? Are you having a stroke? Blink once for yes, twice for no. The infernal blueprints. Nice. That's some good weapons there. We're getting ready to uh, liberate the last of the uh, 
derelict systems. This is not the one we were looking for. Uh, what was that? Oh, the offer expired. Q. There we go. Just yellow slammer and face first. Hey, you guys. Oh, this is still alive. That was still alive. Oh, one of those brigands fell down. Hey, free AI core. Fantastic. What do you got? Uh, nothing really worried about. Ugh, this is a terrible setup. You guys need to go all over the place in your in two big groups. All right, there you go. One, probably three. Womp, got him. Um, I mean, I'm taking that. I'll leave the other one. Who's this belong to? I used to belong to Tritachion. Tell you what, buddies, you're back in the game. Be good, or I'm gonna come back and change my mind. Do Q and Akari. Akari. Piece of cake. I don't want any of that trash. <sighs> Winters of Aiden? Good. Now you guys have like a million troops. Alright, whatever. Go for it. It's probably gonna be a three rounds. Quite a few things there. One. Two. Three. All right, same story. Who did this belong to? Try Tachyon again? You know what? Feeling generous. Take it back. Let me get them supplies. Here's some rocks, or plates. <clears throat> I see what you're doing there. And uh, I'm gonna let you finish. 
Be quick about it. Guys. Gu guys. Alright, come on. Let's go. Let's One v one me. Two v one me. I don't care. No shields. Come at me. Yeah, I'm killing you, my point defense guy. I'm not even gonna lance you. Get out of here. Defenders. The brave defenders fought valiantly. Alright, what we got going on here? Nothing. Is that just naked commerce? No, they do at least have mining as well. Okay. Who does this belong to? Persian League? Nah, that sounds like MRR Mesha to me. I wish I pet would look along great with Tritachion next door. You guys have fun now. I'm out of here. Alright. Dag on. Forgot to buy supplies, but there's this is not Dagon. Dagon is over there. I'm just YOLO slam in. I don't care what's going on here. and chill see this is like proper background faction noise i'm expecting it to drop at some point though no it's just chill the whole time oh this is great 10 out of 10 love it it's just subtle you know not too loud it's there though what do you want no you're not giving up my sick ass mechs Oh, it does have a beat, but I mean, like, it, it, that was just good in general. I love it. All right, what do you guys got going on? Um, that's a big one. I don't think you're gonna do a too job, too good of a job there. Hold on, let me throw my transponder on. Uh, aid the attackers. Uh, we'll bring just the big boys and mama. Oh, you know what? We have a little bit of reinforcements left. Uh, let's bring you as well. You're great. Marking time for commencement of combat. All right, guys, go in. Oh, they have the sabers out. Knives out. Go. I need some flux. My lasers aren't strong enough without it. Ah, <laughs> oh, yeah, there you go. I need some more flux. Hit me with them cannons. Oh, that was some suppose. Not exactly what I wanted. Oh! Mommy! Ah! Put me back! I got it over my head! 
She's like, you're fine. Trying to keep the lag down to a minimum, but all the fighters are on the screen right now. All right, we gotta crack this armor off so that we can uh, start getting into the juicy center of this station. Ooh, ooh, lollipop. Oh, we missed it. You know what? I think I can wedge myself in here. Yeah, I can. <laughs> I get scammed, nerd. They have some brave carriers, this group. Hey guys. <laughs> I cheesed him again. Oh, that vigilance. You are face tanking everything. Yeah, you need to go back. I'm trying to shield you. Is that? No, that's theirs. I thought that was mine. I No, that is mine. What are you doing up here? Is it just us? All right. Mm, boop, boop, boop. All right, we need to take that. I was gonna say, we need to take that thing down. It's getting annoying. I mean, this vigilance is out here putting in work. You know, we probably didn't need the support. The Toho intensifies. Ah! Oh! Right in the mouth. We're all right. Hey. Oh, hi. How you doing? You know, the fight's over, right? Only one. Our paladin went down. <laughs> Literally built him around a paladin. But that AI core saw my dick laser and was like, hold my beer. Alright, um... Who did this one belong to? Tritachion. You know what? I, uh... Really hope you guys learn to get along. Oh. That's disgusting. All right. Wait, were those stations in a fight with each other? In faith, we find strength. In the stars, we find purpose. Yeah.
Oh, that trash got in my way. Oh, one of the spriggans fell down. It's alright, buddy. Get yourself up. We're invading today. Oh, we're taking that. You know the rest, though. Oh, they heckin' love us. Alright, I think that's the end of the derelict scenario. One way to check. Consumers of food. By faction. There's four! It's one here. No. Ultimate Kowal... There's the one in Vecna. They're all over the place. No, they're mostly in Hadriel and Lilith and Kowal. Okay, all right. Vecna. Is there a gate here? There's not a gate here. Just zoom straight to Vecna. No supplies. Uh oh. I'll buy it all. It's like, all right, better go with my transponder off because I don't want to be rude or on. Want some, some machines? Cool. See you guys. Thanks for the stuff. This is back now, right? All right, which one? That one. <clears throat> All right, uh, someone out here will sell me supplies, right? At the terminal? Oh, Myriad Habitat. They'll sell me supplies. Get them supplies. Bonk. Don't care, free port, uh, trash, um, and my guys, uh, independence, oh, held by Tritachion, you got it, <laughs> the rise of Tritachion from the grave, no one would have guessed, oh yeah, 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 uh, get rid of that, and, shady person? Away we go. Uh, no gate here, right? No. All right, we have to go to Ultimate Qual, uh, Lilith, and Hadriel. Qual, Hadriel, and where's Lilith? Where is Lilith? I thought Lilith was like a, a system. There it is. All right, so Paul, Lilith, Hadriel. Okay, close enough. Hey guys. Uh, 
You guys got that? I'm gonna go after these guys. I love that shield spike on that guy. No! As soon as I saw where he was, I was like, that guy's gonna blow up, and he did. That's what he does. Take the devil's medals. Uh, let's just go in. I'm sick of waiting. Make it happen. Saving. Probably three or four turns. Originally belonged to the Ludic Church. You go. See ya. That's round one. This one. That. Little terminal on. No, Mox. There it is. Uh, we invade. Instantly take everything out of supplies. Uh, double check, nothing. All you, I need those. Need those. Here, you can have these. Found them in the warehouses I raided. Trading post, maybe some supplies. What's the biggest planet in the system? These two, Han or Han. Bonk, boink, boom. The average distance between asteroids and the asteroid belt is huge. It's 300,000 kilometers, which is wide enough to fly the entirety of the planet Earth through the system, easily missing every single one of them. Like you could just do donuts in the asteroid belt. I feel like they're coming in to invade someone. All right, what's their military objectives? They're coming in to strike mission over there. Gul Kuei, that's our first one we're going for. Nope, 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 nope. We're taking it. It's fine now. Our enemy ships here. Hey, you know what? Guy, how about you come with me? Let's keep you out of trouble this time. I mean, you'll still be in trouble, just a different kind of trouble.
Oh, that's everyone. Oh, sorry for the lag. Oh, it's so bad. Oh, we'll put the shield up just in time. Congratulations. Yeet. Uh, uh, sure. Nah, we'll attack bomb. Boop. Gimme. Yoink. Uh, wow, I was expecting to find a uh, boy here. Who does this belong to? Hegemony? Not anymore. Shady person? No shady person. If one shady person. All right, last stop. Wait, no, this is the last stop. Nolan Mer Mengrila. Oh, we can bring in uh. The other boys, too. Alright, let's go. A uh, speech, found them in the crowd, make connections. Yeah, free crew. Uh, who do you still belong to? The dictators. You know what? I'm feeling generous. Give them supplies. <laughs> Alliance offer from the MRC. That is not the hegemony. Who are you guys enemies with? Just pirates and pathers. No. Your allies, your enemies with everyone. Ugh, you're, like, you're gonna get us in a lot of trouble, buddy. We'll think about it. Percy and League. Will they even take this from me? Oh, they will. There you go. Now. Sumers. Faction. No. Derelicts. Anywhere. Derelicts are officially exterminated. Oh, 
Hold on. Something else I want to do. You behind. <clears throat> um. It's two slots. Uh, we'll leave you guys behind. That's six slots. And I'll leave you behind for now. I think that's enough. Seven slots. I think six was enough. Was it that one? That one? That one? That one? Hey, all this crap all over the place. We gotta clear this out next time. Murder base! Alright, right, 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 right. Murder base. I know where murder base is. I do not know where murder base is. Where's murder base? <laughs> oh, it's, it's there. Gone. Where specifically? Not by storage. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> Ritachion mercenary. The and that's where I'm going to cut when I chop this up. <laughs> oh. Seriously, though, I just fucking brought them back. So we've got a lot to jump back into on Monday. And on Monday, I'm going to have everything set up so that we can pull a lot of the lag out of the screen. I'm looking forward to that. Um, for anyone who missed it, I'm going to be capturing with the capture card. We're going to be using that so that my laptop can capture the footage from my desktop. And the laptop will be running OBS instead of the desktop. This will allow us to uh, completely ignore the lag as the game decides to chew up everything. Oh, it was a lot of fun so far. I kind of like having all the derelict everywhere. I wish that there were more colony items that got deployed, though. But uh, it's all right. It's fun. And uh, we're not done. We're going to go in there and uh, spend some more time uh, nitpicking with our planets. Um, still haven't allied with anyone. It's definitely not going to be Tritachion now. <laughs> I don't think it's, I don't like the idea of it allying with the MRC. They're, uh, they're too spicy. There are too many enemies. Not about that. Um, still a bit of the church if they want to send an invite my way, but I don't know. I might just keep going it alone. And, uh, need to take care of the hegemony next. Because they're going to send another AI inspection. But, uh, we'll probably, what we'll do for, is, um, step back a bit. And see, uh, see what happens. And... Well, I mean, Kardashian messed with us, so now we gotta go mess with them. But, uh, I'm not gonna wipe them out. I'm just gonna, you know, teach them a lesson. Make them an offer they can't refuse. You give me peace, I stop delivering fuel to your planet's airdrop. Something along those lines. Bonk. I saw that guy. Come on. 
He can't drive. <laughs> oh. All right, I have to run. We need to raid someone real quick. I'm going to guess based on the fact that you all are here. Oh, somebody else playing? Hey, John's playing. Um, I mean, I know it, guys. I know he's got follower only chat, but he's well worth following. I, I mean, he's literally went in. Oh, <laughs> he literally went into the game blind, and everything that he's doing, he learned on his own. It, it, it's it's very interesting to watch because he does things, you know, in such a different way sometimes. Just about to say, I landed at Star of the Stream straight after coming back from the night shift, and it's the yeah, end. Yes. <laughs> Sorry, but hey, as soon as the stream cuts off, you can re actually, I think you can rewind it right now all the way back to the beginning and watch the whole thing over again. <laughs> it was a heck of a stream. It's worth it. We, we it was basically non I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm not sweating, but like it's, it's humid in here from my computer chugging nonstop. I've got to get some lag reduction in here. Anyway, let's go visit John the German. Um, like I said, I highly recommend following. And uh, oh my lordy, there's an ad break on Twitch while I'm trying to raid. <sighs> Great timing, Twitch. Thank you. I I've raided this guy forever. Why don't they suggest people that are actually playing Star Sector first? But yeah, I'll be back on, um, actually, there will be a stream over the weekend. Because once I get everything set up with the capture card, I have an even faster strategy for beating Nexulin. I think we can get it done under three hours, maybe under two hours. It's a dumb strat. And I love it. And this is with the frigate start. And if that goes fast enough, I have another idea. It might be even faster, but it's not the frigate start. It's an own faction start. But um, yeah, so sometime over the weekend, maybe Saturday, maybe Sunday, not certain, but I'm going to rearrange the stuff. And then when I get everything on settled on OBS, I'll go live with that. And um, sometime over the weekend, the last episode of Armstrong will go live as well. It'll be a big chunky one because like I said, there's not really much left for Armstrong to do. I'm locked on the 3X raid in WoW Classic here on Sunday. Oh, rip. Well, if you can, you can. If you can't, you can always follow the VOD. <laughs> but thanks for showing up, Camel. Camel. Camille. I called you Camel. My apologies. Camille. I'll see you around. And let's head off to John the German over on Twitch. And uh, see you later, YouTube. Thanks for watching.